Welcome to the Cultaholic Wrestling Podcast. If you like a lot of wrestling on YouTube, join our cult. Hello and welcome to a very special Christmas present, but only if you've been a bad kid. <laughs> this, finally, is the watch-along of the first ever podcast we did. Better than any lump of coal you could possibly find oh, underneath yes. the, uh, the tree or the stocking. You're listening to the Tones of Matthew. You're listening and looking at Jack, looking worried. Yep. And Ross looking magnificent with big I black beard. cannot wait for this. I've come dressed as Santa Claus for this episode. Yes, you have. Three lumps of coal on the first ever podcast dating January the 12th, 2018. Oh, oh dear. It's oh, a no. Bobby Dazzler. But we're going to go through different segments, aren't we, today? We certainly are. We're going to segment this. We're going to do a little introduction. A look at... Uh, at this, we have a clicker to stop so we can try to explain our actions. Um, <laughs> Your Honour. Yeah, exactly, for, for the jury. <laughs> and then a retrospective look at the wonderful comments, which I'm sure will be very supportive and productive. Yeah. Uh, probably more productive and supportive than we were at the time when we made the bloody thing. Mm -hmm. So, have either of you, because I've never watched this back. <laughs> I never watched it the first time. I, I think I watched it five no. seconds of it and went, well, that's enough for me. There's one camera movement at the start, and that's as far as I've ever gotten. Because okay, that bad. one camera movement is enough. <laughs> it's, a, it's supposed to be the, dynamic and cool. and Yeah, it's a bit Hitchcock. Extreme oh, Hitchcock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Jimmy Hitchcock, his <laughs> unrelated non-union cousin. Oh. But yeah, it's how it came about. I remember like the very origins of Cultaholic being formed at certain someone's house, at a certain someone's birthday sesh. Oh. Me nonchalantly saying... Oh, you'd be hearing the news of what was happening at the at the insurrection, but the good one, not the other one, and saying, uh, hey, can I be involved somehow? And they were like, yeah, we'll find something to do. I don't remember. Uh, and a few weeks later, or months later, I guess, uh, here was something for me to do. Mm. But what I remember thinking is, oh, cool, it'd be interesting to see how these cool companies, they get together, they create this thing, and how the energy is formed and all this. And what it ended up being is, okay, Matthew, come along at this date. Uh, Jack and Ross are both really tired because they've been recording all day. Did you say that? Because they're very busy. Cool. Well, get set up and we'll set you up and we'll start recording. I'm like, oh, okay, we're not going to meet up and discuss what we should do or any ideas. Or in the case of me and Ross, get to know each other beforehand. So it literally was, okay, lights, camera, chemistry. Yeah, and that's not how things are done, are they? Because yeah, I remember the the get together. I remember being in in the kitchen specifically of of Jack and Sam's house share. Oh, so is I, this where it is? This uh, where it happened? Uh, well, it was Cult my birthday. Cultaholic was already in the works, obviously. I think we'd left the old place by then, and we went round to his for prinks. Oh, pre drinks for before going on a night out to rise. I think it was if memory that's serves. Right. I remember distinctly being stood in the kitchen opposite you going. Don't you crap on us on Twitter because I had a bit to drink and I didn't know you. I, that's the first time really I've spoken to you. Yeah. So my outlook from you, you always had a little, a little bitchy tweet about us back in the day, Matthew. You always had a little bitchy tweet. Yeah. So we, I thought well, we Matthew were, doesn't we like were, us. We were the Death Star. We yeah. were the evil empire yeah. of wrestling YouTube. Like many people my age, it's taken a long term, that long time to get used to the fact that, oh no, no, YouTubers are celebrities now. I'm fine oh, now. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, See, I don't know, I don't know. I'm like, that's grand. That's grand. But there is a certain period for people like myself raised on magazines and articles. Celebrities, traditional media, it, yeah. and going, oh, this is right. No, no, I'm past that point now. Yeah, uh, I don't regret anything I said because probably deserved. That's but, where yeah, my... I appreciate you leaving the that going. Oh, Matthew's a bit of a. He's not a friend, friend. Uh, yeah, because I was so, a bit like, shit, you know, I don't know if you remember, I was a bit shifty. You're like, oh, he doesn't like us here. What we, what we in this kitchen with him for? He's the enemy. I was very loyal to my team back then, but uh, yes, it's it's weird how far things have come. But as you say, that was literally how it was brought about. You asked. We were like, yeah, let, let's do it. And then it was a Thursday. Yeah, sounds about right. Afternoon. Yeah. Um, I remember going in the office and having the pizza table set up, as you find in any local takeaway. <laughs> no, um, I know about that. no chairs, all stood up. <laughs> and then Adam just sort of stood behind the camera and the camera being turned on and going, right, off you go then. Here's the, <laughs> yeah. here's the format. Uh -huh. me, I think me, Adam, and uh, and Jack and Sam must have had a little talk beforehand going, oh, what's this podcast going to be? And Adam had all these segments like sort of laid out. And I think the segments are still largely there today, apart from this week in wrestling. Yeah. That wasn't there at the start. Yeah. Mm. Hall of Fame was, which yeah. we were told, big up. Like It's, it's the most meaningful <laughs> yeah, thing in the history of your world. Uh, which, that lasted a few weeks. <laughs> 
No, I had a bonus. Like still to, means a lot to me. Oh, sorry. I mean, yes. <laughs> I'd like to throw. I think Hall of Fame was my was my ooh, was it your was idea? My, I think Hall of Fame was my idea, you know which, is is because, which is ironic because which is ironic because I never I'd never try <laughs> these days. <laughs> but you know. But I remember just Adam stood behind the camera going, "Right, we're off. It's recording. Let's go." And then obviously we didn't know each other. You, you two knew each other, though, didn't Me you? Me and Jack knew each other from, bit, yeah. from the hoodie you're wearing, from Rise Night Rise, Out. But yeah. it was like, so it's the first time we'd spoken to each other. It hasn't been, are you all right? Yeah, no. yeah. This song's good. You know, whatever. <laughs> and uh, yeah, uh, don't worry, though. You can barely tell that we didn't know each other very well. It was, looking back, maybe a couple <sighs> of pilot episodes that didn't get released would have been, you know. Yeah you know nice but back then we didn't have a pot to piss in <laughs> so all, like, was, all systems go the yeah. videos out let's try make because the way youtube works behind the scenes and whatnot we start the channel on november the 5th and then right. you don't get paid money until like a way after like a month five six weeks after that so we were just like right content go 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 as yeah. soon as we can get straight to hell launch get the podcast launched so it literally was just like flying by the old seat of your pants it's like getting a job in the 70s you learn as you go along <laughs> oh, big time which is why as eagle eye viewers might be seeing if we're on the right window which i don't think we are, are we on the right window now no we're not you'll see the title for this podcast which is very different to the titles of oh, today. Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, yeah. Why have you clicked there, Richard? The title of the podcast for episode one is Cultaholic Wrestling Podcast, number one. Hashtag Woke and Matt Hardy is half pregnant. <laughs> now, I went to university and did journalism, and I learned Get all about... that Richard. Why are you on Richard, that? Richard, put it there. I didn't do anything. Um, I learned about SEO and all of that stuff, and why that never came into my thought process. And yeah. I was sat there going, oh, let's do funny titles and whatnot. And if Richard wouldn't mind flashing up in the post edit, of course, the thumbnail for Cultaholic Wrestling Podcast number two. Oh, no. Let's do funny thumbnails. It's in the top right, currently. The top right currently. There it is. We no, let it remain there. Me, Jack, and Matthew in a bath. It's eye catching, isn't it? It's eye catching. Well, I miss the. <laughs> in a perfect world where the algorithm wasn't a thing and we didn't have to use co uh, keywords and stuff like that, I'd, I'd keep the funny titles. Yeah, sort of. I'd like the funny titles. Yeah, you're one. right. In an ideal world, we, there would be a bit better, but. But now it's like CM Punk. What is Vince the topical McMahon. thing? Yeah. yeah. Is CM Punk AEW? Question mark. Yeah, yeah. But now it's, yes. So hashtag woken Matt Hardy is half pregnant. What does that mean? We'll find, I mean, we'll I find out. Because we'll it's, find it's out. all like old school. I, um, letter sent to magazines where they'd use the, the title the letter with an out of context bit of the letter. Yes, yeah, mm -hmm. so I can't wait to find out what that, not, what that actually means. It'd be interesting if people are leaving comments on this video, if you let us know, did any of those work? Did you read those titles? What's that? Ooh. I need to click <laughs> I on must it. tune in. Please let us know. I if we don't see any comments, we'll assume that the answer was no. And I think that's the story of how it got set up. There that's really it. wasn't anything more dramatic than that. It no. was surprising, but, I, but when you, again, bit of context and knowing you after several years and hopefully knowing each other a bit better than we oh, used yeah. to, that I get it now because, yeah, we need to put out content. Doesn't matter if it's good, we need to put out content. It was desperate times by that. I mean, it's still desperate times now. <laughs> but, no, but, everything's but, great. Look, look, at, look at the spread we have. Look at this seven-foot Christmas tree we have. Yeah, look at the massive expansion here and look at the minimalist approach the podcast we're about to watch and see if you spot any differences. Now, now seems a good time to start watching it. We do oh, have this clicker here. No. So I have to point out on the camera, wherever that is, because I can't see myself right now. This is the mouse we have. So It's yeah. ergonomic, Matthew. Richard Tubman lo loves an ergonomic mouse. It was the only mouse I could find on the wireless. <laughs> <laughs> it's the only wireless mouse. I see. So uh, we've got it here. So if either you or me want to just grab that and click Where it, we'll stop and have a little talk or oh. just pause. Because Reflect. this is this is essentially three lads looking back at old baby photos themselves. So baby of photos of the... where there's poo all over their bodies. <laughs> embarrassing ones. The winkies are out Awful in the garden and whatnot. Photos. You know those embarrassing ones. Yes, and all our potential partners are coming through. What's this? Oh, uh, come along, the entire world. Come look at these. So, oh, no. without any further ado, the 12th of January, 2018. Oh. Whenever you're ready. Shall we hit play? Go on. Mm, this is the first ever Cult the This Hulk is how it opens, podcast. by the way. See if you notice any differences. To, to pay special attention, dear viewer, to the dynamic camera work, which is all oh. of the extreme with a capital oh. X from the 1990s. So here we go. In Good three, day. two, one, play. The old logo. Good, uh, I like that. Welcome to Cultaholics Wrestling Video Podcast. Oh, where is it? It's coming. Oh. We'll see if this is. It's coming. Good. And. Oh! Oh! Stop, 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 there, please. stop. stop. No, first stop. of all, first of all, <laughs> for some reason, and I, and I don't know why, because we, we should have been selling it a lot better. 
neither me nor Ross look happy <laughs> at all. <laughs> Jack is at least put on a brave face. Brave Ross face. looks like he's been woken up on his day off to come in. <laughs> oh... <laughs> I miss the days when I used to cut my own hair. Um, and it, Jack's sort of like in the 1996 come anyway. It's something's <laughs> happening. And, and he's just like, yeah, that's what I mean. You know what I mean? That old vibe from the 90s sick. Already, and nothing's been said yet. Yeah. I'm like, well, what's he like? Grado t shirt from Matthew there? Yeah, it's a small and it's still enormous on me. I'm using that as a tent. So we've got the. The wall uh, still like looks like that to this day. Yeah. But so that's absolutely fair enough. It's soundproofed. Full on shot. All three of us lit up, so all of the negatives could be seen on all of us. I look disgusting. That was a look when I thought, well, I'm going to be on YouTube. I Richard Tubman like shaking his head behind the camera. What for? The microphone gets me every time. The, the microphone. microphone. Oh, we're going to get to that. Don't worry. We're starting <laughs> from the top and going to the bottom. Right. So first of all, I look like a shaved earthworm right now <laughs> with the best highlights my Axel Dieter cheekbones. Oh, yeah, they're looking sharp. Marcel Bartel ain't got nothing on them. <laughs> no, they're That's looking nice. very sharp. Fantastic. The the permanent black eyes. Every every spot on my expert-ridden face is visible <laughs> from friggin' Jupiter. I think that's me as well. I'm very red. Jack just got red rosy cheeks. He's just had a few jogs around the building. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bless him. And he's got the, oh, you know, as you said, the mm. 90s kid, like, oh, dad. <laughs> oh. And then... <laughs> Ross, the guy who's delivered the equipment, who's been asked if he can give his thoughts on the right <laughs> Rex the tenor. And then we're all stood up. Why were we, why standing? Were we stood up? Why? Can anybody answer the question as to why we didn't have chairs? No. And why we picked a table of that height where chairs weren't applicable? Yeah. I was hoping you would know because. I, I can't remember. Oh, okay, great. This is a bit, there's an artistic direction. I, I imagine Adam goes down to the pub and stands at the bar speaking about, I don't know, ales and Freemasonry. And... Oh, of course, that was it. <laughs> Try to get that sort I of vibe, I need equipment for a pot. Say no more. Here you go, a <laughs> snowball mic <laughs> and a barber oh, table. I'm I'm worried because we've already picked so many floors and we've not yet We're 15 seconds in. We're yeah. 15 seconds in. It's going to be as long as the normal podcast. I'll slap Adam why we've got... Richard's going oh, to... We'll, yeah, we'll find out the background. Yeah, yeah. We'll continue we're researching as we're doing watching it. Watching this absolute travesty. So, uh, apart from all that, the framing is disgusting. Oh. It's a must. It, it, it's, it, if you There's like soundproofing walls, this is the shot for you. Bear in mind, this is in the midst of a dynamic camera zoom out, by the way, which are consistent, oh, yes. I think, all yeah, the way through yeah. the Oh, we'll see how the framing changes. Because yeah. that's Adam what you want from the podcast. Going, <laughs> <laughs> like wow. Kubrick doing The Shining. <laughs> Because it's funny, because it was a two-camera setup. Yeah, why? Until you guys went to... Vegas? Maybe. I can't remember. No, it was something it changed, else. Yeah. Some other trip that I think Sam went on, he took the camera. Maybe it was Vegas. Oh, Japan. And, um, Japan, that was it. And Pachiti or Sam whoever said, apologies, it's only one camera setup. And everyone. And it was an overwhelming, this is much better and nicer. Stop trying to be the Joe Rogan experience. Just use one camera. It feels like we're settled down. <laughs> And it's been like that ever since. But the beginning, I guess you can overthink things. This is how designers see things. Oh, we're going to do this. It could be dynamic. We're going to yeah. cut. It's got like a Wrestle Talk news bit. You know, and all oh. this stuff. Oh. Uh, <laughs> we're friends, right? It's um, like yeah. Raw. It's like Kevin Dunn was in charge. Every time we criticized Kevin Dunn's yeah. editing, I was like, oh, all right. Oh, <laughs> Genie Reckon. So, okay, let's carry on. Borgland, this is Jack who, if this was Zootopia, would be played by a penguin. What does that the mean, The first then? ever reference that, that went over Ross's head in the history of the Cult of Holic Wrestling podcast. I'm mine, actually. I write down a lot of stuff sometimes. So I thought, if I ever do like a stand-up or a comedy bit, I'll, I'll write that down, that'll be good. If it was Zootopia... I'll, then I'll wake up the next day, and I'll put a line through the bits that didn't work. That was one that should have had three lines I, through I, it. I look at, no one laughs, no one reacts. This is me going, we'll do the podcast. I'll just think of something off the top of my head. And you can't tell. Jack looking at the floor <laughs> from social embarrassment. I'm frozen in fear. <laughs> Ross's eyes are thrown off the edge. Ross, Ross looks like, bear in mind, Ross was a few years in now to being like the like the the uh, can I mention him? Ah, the he, character King Ross, right? Where he'd shout and and be loud and bold about wrestling. Ross looks like he's never been on camera before in his life. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, this was like a new, still a new thing for me because I was trying to be more. I hadn't thought of it like more that. More me, mm. you know, because behind the, right. the scenes, I'm very 
quiet well, and shy and timid. You know what? Until you'd said that, I hadn't even thought because I assumed I was... Uh, this is like Lex Luger going to WrestleMania 9 to wrestle Mr. Perfect and going, it's Mr. Perfect. <laughs> you know, he's a super worker, right? He'll help. He'll teach me. And then they lock up and Mr. Perfect went, so what do we do? And he was All like, right. oh, I was relying on you to help us. And they had a crap match. So I thought, well, you guys know about podcasts and stuff, but yeah, you hadn't done, you hadn't been you. No, never. I, oh. I had, had done a few times, but not near as, near as much as doing the shouty bollocks. And yeah. obviously when we meet people at meet and greets and stuff, like that, they're expecting, how are you, right. you dial him, blah, 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 blah. Well, I'm like, hello, nice to meet you. <laughs> so I, that was a bit jarring for everyone, I guess. I'm, I'm, the oh, can you read it out, Richard? Oh, I'm breaking news. Pop. It's a long way away. RNN update. This is why we stood up. We had F4 money. We had, we had F4, F4 money. money. We didn't have enough money for chairs. Cheap table. Okay. No to be fair, that is, as I say, this is, you know, when would this have been recorded? Early January 2018. Was yeah. it, it wasn't the day off back then, was it? It was like a day or two before. Probably. Oh, yeah, you're right. turned it around, so yeah, yeah. I would have had no money. Adam Max announced several credit cards to get us afloat and all that stuff. Plus. Yeah. I remember the day when we had, was it this table? Yeah, the big table brought in. And it was, it was like a... It's table day. Uh, <laughs> I mark on the calendar. This is the day we get the table. Aye, we, we struggled with those little piddly, if anyone remembers, the, the oh, second yeah. setup of the podcast where we finally yeah. got stools which were equally just as bad as standing up because they were so hard and we had to buy cushions for them a week or two later because it was unbearable to sit oh, down yes, for yes. an hour on these horrible stools which are still upstairs. We had the horrible little tables which weren't steady, stationary on the top that spin around. Yeah. So we had to put the, the, the tablecloth on top to sort of pin them down and keep them still. We had, yeah, we had no money at the start. I mean, Other yeah. people make it look so easy, and then you do it, you're like, oh, right. That's the thing. If you go back and watch the early Joe Rogans, as I've done on a, a couple yeah, of yeah. occasions, they're very much the same. Oh, obviously. yeah, they're, they're held together with tape and prayer. Aye, so it's just a shame that we had the sort of the big, the big sort of expectation of the launch, and then that's what we've got. I'm just <laughs> still <laughs> yeah. laughing at the, the fact that I, I'm normally quite... Um, I like to think that I'm quite helpful with with like the this. Uh, it's ironic that I'm saying this now with the the conversational flow of a podcast, nah, right? I, yeah, but and instead, you are, but you've, like, you've what, what told, can you do with that? You've told me a joke and I've gone. Mm. <laughs> look down at the floor. Yeah, how dare you not laugh at something that makes absolutely no bloody sense? Well, I look a bit like a penguin there. But again, this is also the funny. Well, get over the other issue. Jack is being polite now and realizing he has to literally bend over <laughs> at a forty-five degree angle while looking at his shoes to be the same height as me. No, that's the not the thumbnail I'm doing. for this podcast. Is sensational. I'm lent over. Is that the picture of us? That's. That's. I wish we could erase that from you. These the men in black pen. Because I like to point out, I don't mind being smart the height I am, but I'm lent forward. Everyone else is like, you know, looking yeah. palace guard like this. <laughs> yeah. um, and people are like, "Why are you really small?" But there's not much change if I'm stood up. <laughs> I'm much either. There is, there is. But I'd still, is. I'm treating Jack like he's this cute, cuddly person. And like, Matthew, you, you, I, I can literally see the top of your head. No. I... <laughs> so anyway, what does I say after this? Is anything good? And this is Ross, a man who I do not know anywhere near enough to be taking the mick out of Oh, fair enough. Camera. I said Mick. And I nod. So how are you doing, sir? I am tickety Well, all right. I mean, took a pause there. It's going all right. There's chemistry. I said tickety boo because I was watching Peep Show around that time. Yeah, okay. I'm already sick. The much much nicer of my companions. That's why I stood here in this marvellously set. See, straight away there. Oh, God. The much much nicer of my whatever you said next. I'm just saying words. (laughs) Just like, Matthew, say anything. Say anything. I'm like, um... Every time. Ross, uh, Ross who, uh, who barely knows you. I don't already. know you, which he is a shoot. His. He hates us. That's what I'm thinking in my head. Oh, It looks like I'm about to leave. It looks like I'm, I'm getting <laughs> my coat on. on. I'm like, no, that's it. Uh, the marvellously set. Positioning of stood up next to a... Whatever this is. Snowball. Why oh. is it snowball? Because it's round. Oh, my oh, God. Cool. You all right? You good? I'm fine. Oh, we're all I'm dying. Tickety-boo. You're tickety boo as well. I just came off the top of my head. I'm 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 semi tickety boo. Oh. Ooh. Ready Ooh. for the weekend, you know. <laughs> look yeah. at my face there, just looking at you talking. <laughs> <laughs> no laugh, no nothing, just. You look... <laughs> oh. You look like the guy who goes in to buy the the Corbett sketch. He goes in to buy uh, hose. Hose, <laughs> yeah. Um... <laughs> no hose. Oh my god. Uh, at least I'm like, you... I'm like, <laughs> I can't oh, watch just this, man. At least you two are having a great time. Let's continue. Really, this. This, this is what they kept in. <laughs> look at the body language as well. What? Did we have stuff cut out of this? We tried it a few times because I'm like, how about this? Which is like, no, do it again. I'm like, all right. 
So I really, really should have had like a hey, oh, like we do now the, or something planned or something in my head. This is just me trying to do stuff off the top of my head, and it's like Pachita's not going. No, this is rubbish. Just carry on. I'm like, all right, we left that in. That was left in. <laughs> that was good. that was the grand introduction. Oh, yeah, that's it. We oh, you just did that. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> like normal people. Oh, I'm trying my best. And I'm insulting the I'm podcast. I'm still dying inside here. Yeah. Lads, lads, lads. The eternal struggle of a wrestling fan is to pretend to be normal, isn't it? Oh, oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> Ross, you can uh, say words, it's fine. <laughs> All three of us looking at, well, what do we do? <laughs> what's that Lego? What's that Lego song? Everything is awkward. Oh. Everything is awkward when you're not in the teens. <laughs> Look at us, but don't talk to us, please. Um, all right, that's enough looking like we like each other. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't want to watch us talk about wrestling, what? given that we are experts, um, I believe Ross was in New Japan for 10 years, uh, you can listen to Nod, still no SoundCloud words, Ross. And where else? It's coming soon to iTunes. That's soundcloud.com. <laughs> <laughs> that's like uh, first words. It's Ross coming is like, soon to iTunes. Ross, uh, you can see the Ross look like... I wonder if they'll take us back. <laughs> Is it too late? How do I make it through this? I'm worried. Why am I? I'm just like, I'm nervous. I'm going to insult the lack of chemistry. But if no one's saying, yeah, you're right, we're a bit crap. It's like, no, you just insult the podcast. Why didn't we do this again? I can't believe this. <laughs> <we're laughs> <doing this. laughs> and of course here on YouTube. If you don't want to watch us, you can sod off. The probably put on Twitter out of context, make it sound like massive racist. <laughs> I guess that, like, <laughs> what? I guess we should go like through a little rundown of what's going to happen. Go so on, Jack. Go through. Oh, yes. Here's where the professionalism kicks Holics off. is empowering us to talk There's about. no S on the end. Call the Holics. It's called the Holics. Come on now, Where called the Holics? Call the Holics. No, that lasted on, for a while. Man. This is something I need yeah. to address. For the longest time, Matthew, you would introduce this podcast as the Cultaholic Video Podcast, and we never challenged you, even though we should have. <laughs> yes, it's yeah. never been ever been. You called started that. doing it again, like the past few, like about a month ago, for some reason as well. Why did you call it the Cultaholic Video Podcast for so long? Sometimes it's Cultaholic Weekly Video Podcast. <laughs> we got better, didn't we? Yeah. Why did that skip ahead there, Richard? Um, I'm trying to think to switch scenes, but it, it skips in the video. Oh. No, no, he was doing me a favour to get off that one that screenshot. That uh, I don't know because it was the. I swear someone explained to me this is going to be the video podcast because it's going to be the audio podcast. So I assume that was the name. Oh <laughs> right. But like Bruno Samaritino, some of these like <laughs> typos just stick on my head and never get fixed. Oh no. Shall we continue? Is this, no, oh, please. what's going on? Do we have to? I don't want to. This is, this is the this first is one we did. This is worse than I thought it was going to be. It's. I think it's fantastic. No, I think it, it must get. There's been a few podcasts we've done and that's where it's like it's been a bit awkward to start off with because someone's tired or we're late or whatever and then it gets settled down we'll all get it. No, no, but find this, out this, is, this is worse than I thought it was going to be. This is an inspiring story for all aspiring podcasters. It really is. This is where you start from and then look at us now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's a funny sign. Oh, sorry. There's no S on the end of that. Call the Holic, Matthew. It's called the Holic. Come on now, We're called the Holics. Nah, no, really come on, friend. Like. They are called the Holics. <laughs> we, we, we are called the Holic. Comma, oh, God, um, anyway, this is riveting we're stuff, this, isn't it? The news. The news. The news. The good, wholesome news, uh, not the problematic Twitter news. Mm. Uh, you were ahead Max of your time there. <laughs> oh, well, you know, hey, <laughs> more things to wow. change. Isn't this going to be fantastic? Are you not actually excited for it? Or was that just a bit no, of sarcasm? No, uh, not particularly, because oh, it's, it's a gimmick. gimmick. It's yeah, like Joker's What was this for? Oh, what was this for? Christ. Christ. What's a gimmick? Are you not excited, Matthew? I'm no, I don't think I meant for the podcast. I think I'm talking about... The new, maybe Let's I am. Let's go back there. Bring us to talk. There's about. no S on the end of that. Oh, we'll go through that. We'll live through this nightmare. <laughs> 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 no, 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 come on, friend. What's yeah. Matthew not excited for? Come on, friend. Say friend oh, twice. No. Uh, comma, uh, no, fuck yeah. Um, anyway, we're going to be talking about mm. the news. Bit of news. Bit of the good, wholesome news. Okay. Uh, not the problematic Twitter news. Mm. Uh, mixed match challenge is happening. The oh, mixed, mixed match challenge. challenge. You, well, you were right not to be excited. excited. Are you yeah. not actually yeah. excited for it? Or was that just a no. bit of Oh, I'm excited for that. Uh, not particularly. Team Little It's a great. gimmick. It's yeah, like Joker's Wild or Battle Bowl. It's like... Okay. Oh, I was way right. off the mark there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Way off the Well, the camera changed. Well, Battle Bowl and... They're always good. But I wasn't expecting them to have such... shoot up? Such big stars. It's going to be the main event, isn't it? And it is. Some of them are. I, I, I mean, Nakamura yeah. and Ballard. So oh, glad Ballard. with that beard. I mean, Jesus. So spotty. Well, Look at that neck on SmackDown anyway. He's going to win the Rumble. Mm. I reckon. <laughs> oh, yeah. Quick, quick pause. You can tell I was spending way too much time on Twitter and hadn't been speaking to real people on podcasts and stuff because I'm just full of this. Well, we all know what we're talking about, ladies and gentlemen. Like little bubble <laughs> that I was living in. So I'm just saying these things and expecting. We all know. It's like, 
No, it's not Twitter. You need to tell us what you're thinking, you idiot. Yeah, one thing not all clairvoyance. 2.4 thousand likes on this video. Oh, it's a shame they got rid of the dislike bar, isn't it? <laughs> that would have been perfect for today's Over podcast. Over 2,400 people saw this and thought, yeah, this is for me. Out of 81,000. That's a decent strike rate, that. That's pretty good. Where? Sorry. Tweet Finn Balor and Sasha Banks <sighs> teaming up against Shinsuke Nakamura Ooh. and Natalia. Oh, a pan. Still Club looking miserable. Going to Natalia. Uh, the you look like mournful all man. Oh. Okay, that, that skit was funny, actually, because it's like, who am I going to get? I'm going to get, oh, it's Asuka, I'm winning. The problem yeah, with, I, like, I like that. I like that. The problem um, with standing up as well. and Carmella. Like, I have no Bones idea what I'm doing with Bliss. my hands at any point. Mm -hmm. Well, normally podcasts would have stood up, have you? No. I don't know why that is. They were a comedy duo in the 70s. People still. have money to spend on chairs. <laughs> uh, <Goldust laughs> There's a 70s Fox. reference. Press a button. Uh, we'll Jack be Lock. taking on Jimmy Uso and Naomi. Okay. They, they're going to win this whole thing. Are you still just stood there, Ross. Is that, that table moving? The lights all went off and the thing. music played. Jostled. And she jumped into his arms and he was like, yeah, it's you, we're going to oh, win. Focus, and then the lights went right. down. It was Daniel Bryan in a wig. And he was like, get off. What are you doing? And then oh, Daniel Bryan was like, sweet beats, it's back together, bro. It's a bit disturbing. I can't tell the difference between his wife's body and Daniel Bryan's body. I mean, Daniel Bryan. When they walk, then you know. <laughs> oh, oh, yes, and again, realizing yes. you don't have to add on great, a thing after every time someone Elias, speaks. We've taken on Bailey. We don't get to first name. Uh, uh, cameraman, uh, take the camera. No reaction again. <laughs> Rock, Rock's not laughing. Mm. Why we should got he? Punished for being together. Yeah, you should have said when he gets a surname. The got punished because they watched Dolph. They would have been on the floor. Rusev for four months. Yeah, but he introduced Lana to denim and America. Yeah, and everything was all right. It was all right. Again, you should have just laughed at that rather than trying to add on. Nia Jax, we're taking on Bobby Roo and Charlotte Flair. Who do you think is going to win, just immediately from that? I'm going Miz and Asuka, me. You all right? Oh, man, you all could right? Be, could be Finn and Sasha Banks. There's no it could be effort in my voice, is there? No, it can't, it's not going to be Rusev and Lana. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Lana, Lana's not really a strong wrestler. She's been oh. training with Roo Roo. I saw the, I saw the, I saw through, the skits, yeah. He's been hard on her. Oh. Bless her. <laughs> oh, that's really that, was that was good. Oh. That was that was that supposed to be a point. Anyway, oh. uh, I I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yes, that's what you meant. Wasn't it in English? Singing encouragement. Nearly five minutes oh, in. Come on. Like him. <laughs> it's Lana's training. No, that was really good. No, stop. That was that bad, actually. Really, thank oh. you. Cheers. Ross? I hope he serenades them, Great. like in Blackadder the First at one I've speed. never watched that first uh, season. What? Why was just talking Blackadder Black the Adder First? Uh, I think Bobby Roode <laughs> and Charlotte Flair are going to win. No one likes Blackadder Again, the first, it's not that this is going to be bad. It's like with Raw and SmackDown and NXT and 205 Live and blah, 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 blah. It's like, all right, fantastic. Mixed match. That, 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 when, when you're sleeping, you should be watching WWE. I, I reckon <laughs> that is true. There's a lot of WWE. In God. <laughs> Look at it's how interesting awkward that it's it is. <laughs> Where, what are you looking at? The future. Mm. Yeah. I've oh, got yeah. no yeah. idea. Right. Uh, More padding on the walls. Doing like Amazon and taking over half the planet. It's called Facebook Watch. Yes. Yeah, right, okay. Oh, yeah, Facebook Watch. Hey, I tell you, if I was a fan of the channel, I'd have turned off by now. Yeah. Never mind. I'd have skipped ahead to see if it picked up. That starts this week, doesn't it? Tuesday. Tuesday. Yes. 4 a.m. our time, isn't it? It's at least better than the Angry Video Game podcast. Oh, sorry. It's going to be on the network. Yeah, but like, it's a total finish. I can't remember. I should have read that a bit harder. Mm. Could be interesting. Yeah. I think, More dead air. I the article of mm, podcast is to have just, as much dead air as possible. You know? With the pie. Has it been established whether the men can what? fight the women? A game of I tennis. Think <laughs> <laughs> I think there could be a big heel. Like, whoa, what have you, you done? You know what? You should start the podcast. The Three lads talking about forever. a show they don't care oh, yeah, about yeah, for yeah. five Striking minutes. Down a woman. That would be it for the career. Austin battered Lee with a chair. Different that time. was like 2001. Yeah. yeah, it'd be great. Like Tommy Dreamer's introduced to this, and everyone's like being really careful. Tommy <laughs> Dreamer's gives one of them a pal driver. Can we put this on two two All times the speed? I <laughs> really don't want to. Yeah, announced. probably. Like, yeah, the date has been announced. It's such, September first. Such a such a a cool new age marketing campaign, isn't it? On the Twitter. Yeah. All in. All the fans were doing little joke ones. I saw it in My... Facebook. Kid like us. <laughs> He's more reliable than the real Kid Like Us. Oh, for those who don't know, Kid Like Us is a British wrestler who gets injured all the time. It's all right, he laughs about it too. You harsh man. Oh, oh funny Matthew with his funny joke man. and his double chin and your friggin' cheekbones and your sh Matthew just swore for the first time. He... It's all right. I don't, that know, I, I, don't know. I don't know what he looks like without the mask. Of course you do, come on. No, I, I mean, I know plenty of people that look like without the mask, but I don't know what Kid Like Us looks like. You could be Kid Like Us for all I know. I shouldn't know what he you looks like, like, but I genuinely can't you talk them. I do know what, <laughs> what Kid Like Us <laughs> looks like <laughs> in yeah, real life, yeah. But it just come up sometimes with, you might Phil know Mitchell, each other, mutual friends. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah that's hey, him. this? And it's like, oh, it's 
I was like, oh my god, it's We're just now talking Sorry, about man. something We're that really Ross will have no. I can't wait for it to no, 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 go no, to the wide again to see how riveted oh, Ross yeah, is by the. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, John. Amo's been there on my Facebook page for a while. I'm not going to say his real name, otherwise, all you stalkers will hunt him down, but he's been there on my Facebook page. Killian Dane. Killian Dane's real name. Yeah. No, I mean his actual Facebook page. Killian Dane. His fake, his fake name. <sighs> I see. I don't know. That's a good joke, Ross. Born How about me and Jack just run over it with our car call, a few times? I call him Big Dame. It's really lucky that he's still looked off into the distance. Yeah, oh, yeah. How would be ironic? Name. He used to be uh, Small Dame, didn't he? He's seen that progression of pictures through his career. Yeah, he used to be Small Dame. Sounds drunk. Name was <laughs> yeah, I've seen Medium Dame. He's seen that through his, his career. Uh, all In, which will not feature Big Dame. So all In? Know. Well, you never know. Yeah, at this point, who do we think it's going to feature? Because oh, he was probably interested oh, okay. so far at the time. Of uh, Kenny Omega, the yes. Young Bucks, yes. Cody Rhodes, yes. Yes. Stephen Amell. Yes. yes. Yeah, Hangman Page. And yes. I'm one of these people that doesn't watch our We are experts. I don't know who Stephen oh, Amell is. He can hop the top rope, though. I remember that he one. He did. The SummerSlam. Yeah, yes, again, people were like, yay, Arrow, the guy from Arrow's in this. And it would be we're warming up now. Look Arrow, at this. But I didn't. So I was like, Oh, you know, if, if, if Kevin Spacey and Hulk was in this, would have been Oh, Kevin Spacey mentioned. Well done, well. Matthew. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah, don't worry, there's but, probably uh, going to be a lot of problems. Yeah, yeah. It's going to be to see, like, Steve Amell do, you know, a headlock and they'll be like, oh, my God, a headlock. He did. That's re- exactly what happened in the match, he though. He wrestled well. He wrestled well. Which I think is quite yeah, cool. I'll brag about that. He's undefeated. Yeah, of course he is. Do you know who else is? Oh, go on. No, I got pinned again. By oh, the, uh, oh, why am I talking about I'm not oh. actually undefeated. I've got like a 50% record. <clears throat> oh, the jagged shrug. I like that. Be Trying. Uh, that already. Jack- be announced. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Who would you have uh, if you could pick any oh. uh, action star? Oh, action star. Yeah. Oh, to be Tom to, Cruise. To on, Tom Cruise. <laughs> um, so you might just make lower. Oh, who would I have? Can you get lower than Tom Cruise? I was going to say, yeah. Hey! Someone from any era. Yeah. Podcast okay. is so um, bloody white. <laughs> so reluctant. Do you think of rules there? Have, fix um, thing just and different up variations of white. It's not white balance. Daniel Son and Mr Miyagi from Karate Kid. Is he an action hero? Yeah. Yeah, I guess I can. I guess. If I'm going for proper, have a great career afterwards. So I yeah, not, if I'm going half for half proper action hero, I guess I'll go whenever, for that. Is. Whenever there's dead air, James Bond. I can like hear it. Golden is a wonderful film. Really good. It's a good good Bond film, but the bad good Bond films are also good. Marvin Harry from Home Alone. <laughs> We've, none of us have changed. I've just talked about James Bond. Ross is talking about Home Alone. They would make I'm like, Mega Drive games. Games. They would. Uh, Yes. They're all in. Well, I was going to say Michael J. White, but you've blown that away. So. <laughs> right, I've hit the 10 minute mark. Come on. Ross has got no idea who Michael J. White is. Uh, yeah, I don't know references, about references, references. <laughs> God, I'm funny. September, 1st, hope you September the 1st, which is. Slit my throat. A long time after someone whose name sounds like Daniel Bryan may or may not be with the company. Oh! Well, Swinging a miss. You're only, you're only three so years behind. going to be announced on the next Being the Elite, apparently. They're doing social media so well. They are. Yeah, they're um, Being the Elite. Podcast, no, no. And I guess... Excuse me. That's all right. And I guess that, like, <laughs> oh, and no. cities, then CM Punk speculation. Jack, is this my first oh, drink I've had in, like, a day? Or what am I? <laughs> Bringing every know. 10 he's seconds. making love that cup, aren't he? Yeah, he is. I'm following the pattern of my wristband, me, which has been might, will he wrestle everywhere. Him? I can't stop fiddling with it. might make a cameo appearance. This might be the best chance of him seeing it. It might be in Joey Janela's spring break. <laughs> but people won't, won't... They'll say CM Punk's going to be there and no one will believe him because he'll be there to see Dink the Clown makers. Come back. <laughs> Who was at the last joint? Was it Virgil? No, it was good. Joey Janela was at the last joint. The delivery was a bit. He wrestled him, didn't he? Very recently. Big Kirby. Martin, Martin Kirby. Kirby. <laughs> I saw you said Big Kirby. I'm like, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> um, big Kirby. I mean, I guess he is big back. to some. I, I mean, thought Virgil. Sorry, Martin. It was Janetti, wasn't it? I thought Virgil was on the show because I've seen a gif of Janela. Giving Virgil a Can- of oh, Virgil giving Janela a Canadian. Yeah, destroyer. that was at the PCW's version yes. of the Joey Janela's thing. We've the been all over the place to- topic wise. Yeah, what the I can't hell? tell what's going on. Yeah, because they're doing that again. We, just, we still, we still do that. Hey, to all be fair. gets a plug. Joey Janela's spring break. Uh, no, we don't. Know, we just stick to the rest of the night. Yeah, yeah. And it's a controlled frenzy, as Michael Cole would say. Now, no, it's just way past midnight. And so he went the wall and tapped, and, sticks. and he tried to get back in. He went, no, oh, sorry, this is the story about when well, your mate got kicked out. Omega kicked, well, not the kicked out, wasn't allowed to come acid. back in. Yeah, yeah, my mate, when I started to drop acid, <laughs> it's a good reaction. You know, when I would drop back, acid, um, or a cigarette, um, that's how it's said. So it's said in America. Wait, wait, it's not my fault, Americans. It's a language. 
Um, and he was denied entry. Oh, no. Oh, or re-entry, I guess. Uh, I wish I had a tab of acid now. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> and there's a night to come back in. Didn't say... By Boring way, stories told worse to by Matt. That's, that's very cool. So there's a lot of stories that phone we've told multiple and times, I'm realising. We're in America, so we, I was the guy in charge of Uber. So I had to go outside and like... Oh, that is the thing. My, phone, my, phone, my friend couldn't figure out Uber was in Uber America. Then going back in. Oh, but that's good. I wasn't thinking clearly at the time. And it's about so as riveting as any of my Hall of Fame picks recently. Out, but my, my mate There's a certain idea. charm to your picks. No, we'll let Thank you back you. in, Matthew. You're famous. There's a charm to your like, no one asked for the story and started ranting like, like, like a drunk at a bus stop. I'm a YouTube series, so screw him. So I was like, ah, screw George. And then I was like, ah, saw it all on Twitter, the gifts. was like, honestly, right? amazing. It's what people tune in for, Matthew. Cool. What are you doing Thursday, Matthew? What are you up for tea? Live events people, not the George and others people. Fascinating. Apparently, they had Matt Riddle versus Dan the B7. Yeah. But they wanted Ken Shamrock, but he asked for like way too much money. Oh, all right. So never mind. Anyway, wow, I'm glad uh, you brought that up. Uh, what colour is tight? 25 is happening. It's 25 years old. What's happening? Oh, it is. It's weird to, to say. I'm yeah, 25 say, years right. old. Oh, Wait, years old. look at me. <laughs> Sorry, Matthew. Um, <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm VHS man here. So. <laughs> I remember uh, VHSs. Oh, um, I wish you were a VHS man, Matthew, so I can fast one? forward what? you. Who's VHS? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I remember. Take it back to the blockbusters. Um, um, yes, so up. Raw 25. The Raw 25. Raw 25 yeah. Oh, God, that part of the crowd. The Undertaker will be there. Steve Austin, Ric Flair, the APA. Did we know it was uh, going to be bad? DX. Mm -hmm. Or were we like, actually excited? These are the same names that they've always been plugging for these special events from like 15 years ago. Like, remember those guys from 98? Snowball audio Yeah, I was going to say, yeah. the only quality that mic's crap. No one that they could connect yeah, with that it's headline. Not, like, there's one of them in the middle of three of us. I understood. And now we have three. Yeah. Like Batista or CM Punk or can't rest like Daniel Bryan. Or they're still headlining. Like it's still Cena yeah. or. Yeah, yeah, that's very valid. Bellas. That's valid that. Oh, yeah, the Bellas will be. Yeah, I think that was it. That was the, mm. the one. We've got we Brother Love. You'd brother hey. Love Pop. <laughs> oh. Surely not. Yeah, he's got podcast to plug. I can't believe it. This was before the Brother Love Pop. Yeah, I know. He's Matthew presented news so hasn't followed up the yeah, news. No, no, <laughs> well, on TV. I, I think it was in, on the website at least. Just believe oh. us, Matthew. It's fine. <laughs> Wait, TV, why is the we could arrest him for a living, Matthew. Why don't you listen to us? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I was talking the most oh, in that oh, bit, but oh. Pachini just kept the guys, just you and Ross, just both just listening. <laughs> oh. <coughs> No, I was never excited <laughs> for coffin. brother. I love your oh, coffin. That's, that's been great. Oh, to be fair, I'm glad that coffin went away that I had about a month or two ago when I was ill. He's worse than me trying to do... Ross was... No, I said he should have gone to the Ross doctor. was angry at me. A <laughs> couple of months it was there. Mm. It was there oh, for a while. Character. Hinting at something what? more <laughs> severe. <laughs> yeah, luckily it just went away. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Big I, I, laugh. Yeah, I'm that glad was, that you were there. Oh, bless him. Ross nice still suit. stares off into the distance. Nice hairdo. A table shaking. Same about his hairdo. Lots of... Every time you push any... Lots in lots of boxes for me. Do you really like Brother Love? Do you really like Brother Love? No, I'm just trying to make it seem like a good thing. Um, really have do you think by this point, in our heads, we were still thinking, right oh, God, or do you think we weren't like... Oh, no, I was thinking, I'm the third wheel here, lads. I am struggling You were thinking, you were the... All of us thought we were like, no, no, you're the wheel. No, you're the wheel. I think we're three triangular wheels. That's the thing. A blue car from Mr. B. Like, left. Hogan? Yeah, it won't be Hogan. I don't think it'll be Hogan. And he was back from Mania though this year. <laughs> yeah, he got better. And various other things. Um, <laughs> I, are you going to bang up down? <laughs> Kitchen live show. It's going to be three hours like, as normal, but the live the whole thing will run for five because it's in two venues. I know. Oh, it, it, oh yeah, two venues. Like that, at WrestleMania two. No, WrestleMania two was three, three venues. venues. Like Starcade eight seven. I mean. Yeah. I More eighty stuff. More eighty <laughs> stuff. I guess it'll be... That was relevant, though. Interesting. Oh, it'll be more yeah, eventful than normal roles, but I don't know if anything of You'd hope so. Was this before or after? Christ, if it's not. They Adam suggested the one to put these shows together. The Matthew's made a more reference, more Joe. Was that after a few podcasts? Nine nine was like, right, we've got to I think Ross did that. Maybe we all... Oh, was he? Oh, Christ! For the Corner Hall of Fame! This was before we had... Cal Halbert. The wonderful Cal Halbert. Wait a minute. Imagine that! Well, I'm listening to this, this podcast in the audio form, yeah? So a really boring point about the 80s. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the news kind of just went like... Yeah, yeah let's hear it. Say that really again. Oh, yeah. Bro, the love thing is a surprise to me. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Surely there will be. Like Rikishi or someone. That's the thing, like, <laughs> if the names have announced, who's, like, left? When? Hogan? Yeah, no, wait, we're way back, we're way back here, yeah. Nice, he's doing... Yeah, two hours long. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> I think that's why I do. It sounds really awkward and clunky, but I'll oh go this off. And that was the end of the news. So he is, a bit more oh, we've got to be hyped for he this. Is, he is our attempt of being worry. hype. <laughs> Come on, guys. This means the most on, guys, in the world guys. to you. <laughs> All right, that was a great first take. Yeah. <laughs> this is the most important All thing right. in the world, lads. Oh, Big it up. Here God. we go. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Biggest thing ever. Well, that is funny, though. I can't believe what time it is. I can't contain myself. <laughs> you're in it. You're into it now. <laughs> Why? Fire and all cylinders here. Call of Fame. Never. The first yes. one ever. The first one of many. Right yeah, yeah right. she was. 52 a, a year. <laughs> one a week. Four a month. <laughs> Jesus Christ. No, <laughs> yeah. I'm convinced. Isn't he the first entry? It's massive. And we're all going to pick one, right? We're all going to so pick one. Three. That's three suggestions. We'll go to Patreon. The Patreon will pick the winner, and the winner. That's how the podcast should start. Call the Hall of Hall of Fame. Jesus Christ! It's the biggest Hall of Fame ever. Hashtag cult the holic hall of fame. Well, no, that's too big a hashtag. There's nothing left of the tweet. Oh, the wood now, Matthew. Oh, yeah, Look yeah, how times yeah, have yeah. changed, eh? Yeah. That is my suggestion for the cult the holic hall of fame. While Rusev Day is still a thing in WWE, don't turn him. He like did bad news, Barrett. Was that uh, English? Uh, <laughs> oh, I forgot what you said. Rusev, but... don't turn me <laughs> yeah. like bad news, Barrett. I'm scared it's going to happen. Isn't it the tinsel, do you think? Did you see Smackdown this week? I've, I've got, got a real, real tickle in my throat. You're right. We'll get Smackdown discussion into this a little bit. But when Aiden oh, English yeah. had it, we can. Whoa! Oh, that was badass. Oh, God. Fans for eating hot dogs and cake. I was like, why would a baby face do that? They're slowly going to turn them back heelish, aren't they? And not run with the air. Uh, turn them up. The baby face goodness, which yeah. I'm right. Yeah. So why do you think Rusev deserves to be in the Hall of Fame? While Rusev Day is still alive, we need to cash in on this opportunity. So you're not going to make a case Open your mouth more, man, Ross. What? It's pretty self-explanatory, isn't it? Is it? Yeah. Rusev, Hall of Fame. You've not been around for long. Been around long enough, have you? Right. Yeah, this is the sort of debate. <laughs> Look at this. We're having arguments about people's picks. Don't just Crabbing. accept them like we do today. Do you think we should At least make more... fun of it in a nice way. It's like, why are you picking that? <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with you, man? What? Yeah. Rusev, Hall of Fame. What are you right. tagging about? Because I'd just been informed that this was the most important <laughs> Hall of yeah. Fame. So I wanted to win. I was, <laughs> of course, I was, like, I was going on the attack. First ever induct in the Calder Hall of, Hall of Fame. The single the first ever induct. That's in good the English. Hall of Fame. Yes. I think Rusev's a suitable candidate. He had a good... He had a good... Uh, the old Hall of Fame music. Oh, right. Oh. He did. Because everything has to be an old time. reference. <laughs> it's, it's the best WrestleMania like, reference of all time. Like VR chat levels. Hall of Fame worthy. <laughs> <laughs> Lana had like a polar What's bear around her now? neck. It was yeah. fantastic. Suplex the bear. I'm speaking. It was awesome. Everyone, everything. And the USSR anthem. Camera still's not changed. Again, whatever you want to feature. <laughs> oh, my God. Actually, it's always the USSR thing, the um, hammer and sickle... Fond, but there's, there's wrestling Hammond, and there's what? <laughs> yeah, the, the Soviet Union. I, I, I'm just going off. Hey, of here's a little thing that we're talking about. Well, I'll just get distracted easily because <laughs> I'm... Sorry, there's... Shut up. I, I already thought you were very 90s, but this makes me think you're actually very 80s. You are very 80s, aren't you? Yes. Late 80s. <laughs> yes. Late 80s. And then there's wrestling Russia. Yes. Yeah, they're very... very we're talking about the Hall of Fame, Matthew. Okay. Stay My on topic. Entry, right, is a bit... A bit more serious, right? Okay. <laughs> Great. Is it the camera, <laughs> the goal. <laughs> it was Triple H. Carry on, carry on. Serious. He's the most over man in the E today. This was a nervous laugh. Carry mine on. was the mine was a man who's had several e top-notch WrestleMania entrances. And my childhood favourite, Triple H. He's my. He's you're out of focus, Jack. For the colour holiday. Yeah. Yeah. Favourite was Triple H. Yeah, my childhood favourite was Triple H. On a stage show. Please do, Jack. I've told right, this story so 50 school, times on camera now. I was about year five or six when I got into wrestling for the first time. No, maybe like year... It was the year 2000, right? Now, all the cool kids who were good at football and that, mm. they like The Rock or... Oh, yeah. Have you moved sort of closer to the camera, Jack? They like Rock or... Yeah, I look like a giant. I don't blame you. I look very tall. Like, I identify with Triple H because I wasn't very That's why he's out of focus. Yeah, yeah, It's my fault. Slowly and slowly. This is when we need a this is yeah this is when we need a petite dynamic and I kind of overlooked in, him, him being like a massive heel I kind of overlooked you had a cowie uh, <laughs> yeah and just all the way through like yeah, yeah, sorry Jack you said a point again I was right, sucking a lemon yeah I started drop acid he can't get back here soft spot for him right me and Adam Pacitti went to the toilet at WrestleMania and when we came out right. Why are you laughing at this story? We both just stopped and had a chat, and we were like, oh, yeah, it's been an all right show, hasn't it? Yeah, it's been all right. 
wonder who's coming out next. And then, and then Triple we heard H's the first guitar hits, yeah. chord of Time to Play the Game, and we both ran, we ran. back. It, why are you uh, laughing so much? Carry on. We both ran back to our seats because we couldn't Did miss Did you have that a mullet back then? And boy, how uh, It's long on the back there, isn't it? It's <laughs> <laughs> stringy it was as well. It's not nice. Really on good his little it. tricycle. It wasn't a little bell. tricycle. <laughs> I would have understood boy, if this had been filmed during lockdown, why it got so out of control at the back. And, but I'm not and quite just certain. what a guy, what a man. I'm he's not my favourite these days, but place. he's always my childhood favourite. Maybe I, I was ahead of my time because mullets <laughs> are now they are. back. They are. the Holic Hall of Fame. <sighs> my haircut's just bored him up just front and even more breath in the back. Assassin. That means... Very, very that means agent Smith. Sport. I don't even have a haircut <laughs> That's there. That's what it means. What do you think it means? Austin and The Rock, they fight on it. I mean, yeah, I mean, that's what it means, but when you say it like oh. that, it just sucks on. It comes up with shit, I think. Oh, oh no. like, God. Yeah. No, not at all. What I'm saying, it, it that makes became sense, a thing. The Rock was always a I fighter on instinct, wasn't he? He had loads of heart. Triple well, H, was a? thinks more. The short oh, H being the thinking in. man's wrestler. Or thinking oh, because oh, he thinks yeah. more. Is he that first? Like, yeah. That's fair. Yeah. Oh, that's still. That's good. It didn't but get much of a reaction him, at all, did really it? Not really a fan, therefore he can't be in the Hall of Fame. Why? Because I didn't like him once. I'm really I laughed, but then you went, why are you laughing? I'm like, oh god. I'm, I'm really competitive for this Hall of Fame. You haven't got 100% faith in Triple H. I like my time. Blood. I like my time, Triple H. I like terrorising. <laughs> I like Matthew, an hair. old reference for I you like there. I got it, I got it, old oh, reference, yeah, yeah, it's funny. And my favourite one of all might be um, WrestleMania 30 entrance Triple H, where it was like meta. Like, he was like, well, I know that everyone thinks I'm like this. What do you mean? Just, I'm really I, def- I I'm very defensive about my pick. Apart from the one the first one. It's all about the game. A wonderful sneeze. That was an impressive turn, though. You had a lot of degrees there in your It looked fake. Oh, yeah, no, no, I was Which one was he in the band? The guitarist. Oh. But he knew he knew his bit, but poor old big old Lemmy, he didn't have a clue. We have found well, out he a groove now. The song. It's triple We're all it's riffing. Triple Johnson wrote, it was it's all Johnson, triple 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 Lemmy. Lemmy. The song, they had the credits. We're still trying yeah, to judge. It's like, it's like the Mexican standoff, the end of Good and Bad, the Oakley. <laughs> like, right, he's going to shoot each other. No, I mean... Oh, another old reference. There's a definite underlying tension, isn't there? The game. Do you feel glad that you've got the review show with Tom? Where it's... Just all those references. Who is your number Because I know where I stand with well, Tom. Given that at I was this given point, three minutes to think about you were, this. But you're uh, a man compared to this, you're scared to the next to me, Matthew, so back then. Uh, no, but we, you're right. We didn't <laughs> know <laughs> each other that well. It's like, <laughs> have a conversation uh, with you. This could be us in a pub talking awkwardly. Um, sort of people your own sort It is. I see it. He's not currently in WWE. No chemistry. You've got some guns, though. He's on the 205 Live intro. I found out this week. Can we get Bill with 205 Live and wrestling for this lovely video podcast? And I saw it. I was like, is that him in the intro? Oh, is he back? The intent back muscle. Brian the intent muscle, oh, yeah. yeah. Um, Split apart like Cookie Kingston. Wrestling expert. <laughs> you popped and, uh, your... It was also not on the show. Well, Dean Dips, I didn't work out. It, I went, oh. it went like that, and because I, I, I didn't know what the hell it was, uh, I thought my heart exploded, so I had to wait. Oh, okay, I'm not dead. So, <laughs> when the, when the walking centre and the nurse was like, hey, you lads, you always go all out on the gym, don't you? You should take it nice. I'm like, yeah. Oh, oh yeah, cool, look at us. Chris Masters. <laughs> anyway. Not get him. Uh, so yes, Neville. The fact that he's from Neville, this will be part of the world mm-hmm. to see a positive representation. Will we say the story that Adam saw him in nice Spoons or Sam saw uh, him at the bouncy know, castle place, <laughs> or I saw him when he was drunk <laughs> in town? Neville, he's amazing. We seem to say it every single time we bring him up these days. Newcastle. Think about Newcastle. My it's not Jimmy Nail. This is the first not, time we've mentioned Newcastle uh, on the podcast. No, I mean, we've mentioned Newcastle. Then what were you saying? Ross is like, I know that. God, I know Newcastle. Great. 2017 because he had such a consistent run. Mm-hmm. Like Bad News Barrett, he's been I went, given mm-hmm, there, but it sounded like a fart. Stuff to say that isn't mm-hmm. actually mm-hmm. that good. The Barrett stuff he, he, he had to say wasn't great, but he delivered it so well. Yeah. You can tell it's his input though, because they, they would have a clue. All right, there, lad. All that stuff. Right. Yeah, they wouldn't tell me. Him hiding the accent that. like we're doing now, and like fantastic did, analysis. And those Album, videos used yeah. to do where. No, I hide my accent. No. <laughs> I forget sometimes what They're I'm supposed to say. All right. It's all gan down south. See, they gan. Um, Colin down south, lay. Were we told to not okay. use um, local slang? No. no. Oh, okay. Thank God. Can you imagine? I wouldn't have a job. Yeah. <laughs> no one's gonna. No one's gonna get any of this. Yeah, no one's gonna care. But when I go down south to London, I'll hear the accents and go, ha ha ha. Oh, that's how they talk. That's us. Oh, that's there. Yeah, yeah. Like, I'll tell you, Bob Hoskins, and they'll come up here. I'm sorry. I've totally... Mm. Yeah, sorry, you're on part four of the um, unabridged, so yeah, boring again, Matthew story. Yeah. 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 Nothing to do with what we're talking about. Uh, I'm also not, happy to just go off topic, topic on everything we bring up. Nah. We do that now, yeah, though. Yeah, so people have fun. Now it's just just like, all right, wait for Matthew to shut up. So many people are like, oh, you're not a good employee because you're not doing what the boss is telling you. I'm like, what? 
Like, oh yeah, the old How long have I missed? Than we, yeah, <laughs> yeah what, what, the, sorry, the, I blinked. The, what, we, what, I uh, thought, Rhodes, what page are uh, we on? Sorry, Cody, I, th- uh, I was honestly looking Cody, forward to it today. I thought it was going to be good. I didn't realise this until and someone said, like, um, well, no, it is positivity in the show. See how far we've come. New Japan or whatever, Ring of Honor. She could be Brandy Rhodes. That's not trademark. She's never in WWE. Like, this is making me. So they can go. I didn't like this. Look how nervous I am. I'm tying a knot in my drawstrings on my hoodie. Eden Styles. Oh, yeah, Eden Styles. Cody and Brandy Rhodes. No, that's not. That's not. Canon. That's not. No, no, because, yeah, to get around the name thing. Mix my challenge. Here we go. Yeah, there we go. I'm so So, yeah, War Nev. Um... Fair enough. Yeah. That's a good That's page. It. That's it. Yeah. There's just no rhythm in there. Wait, what was your pick? Pack. Okay, so we've got Rusev, Neville, Neville. and Pack. Three wrestlers. Yeah, no bad news. That was where people say, oh, Matthew, you're a proper Geordie. I'm like, well, you know, I'm from County Durham, technically, but. Yeah, yeah, sure. I'm from, I'm from I thought we were going to get our second Bishop Auckland mention in the podcast. Bizarrely, I am the nearest to Newcastle. Go on, Jarrow. You big Geordie. Jarrow. Well, Am I gonna go Jarrah? Posh lad Jarrah? <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna say. I'm a posh farmer, mate. That's what people from Morpeth are. Yeah, uh, Nowadays, if we had this conversation, I feel like people would enjoy it because we'd actually call it, call it make thing. it all right. Oh, yeah, anyway, but yeah. That, that was, was just us saying where we're from. Keep it local, like we're doing radio. Yeah, what comes yeah. next? Uh, so that was called like, Hall of Fame. Uh, yeah, what Apologies. <laughs> <laughs> Patreon.com slash the camera. Who would point at? You. Adam. I know oh, they're on camera. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that was good. 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 Who? Patreon.com slash the camera. Point the camera. Who? Patreon.com slash the camera. Yeah. Whoa. Wait, wait, wait. Go it's back. Sorry, just back a little tiny bit. Watch for the, watch for, the, watch for when it, we've radio. all pointed, yeah, right? Yeah, and it goes uh, to camera two. Well, and call then call it zooms out. It's watch how unimpressed Ross is. And it's up to you. It's really good. Watch it. Just adjust to fit Ross in frame. You. Patreon.com slash. War lads. We know. We know. We're just going to win. Uh, all Whoa. the rules for the recap this week in wrestling but God, how many people are going to be still in WWE <laughs> on these recaps gotta be eh? gotta be <laughs> oh. <laughs> times were that tough Ross resorts to alcohol to try and loosen up a bit <laughs> am I the only one with a beer <laughs> <laughs> hey why not eh why not <laughs> Wait, I'd love to be a fly on the wall. If I remember, though, we had a, a pretty sizable break between the last segment and the start of this segment, and that's why I got the beer, and I can't yeah. remember. But there was a big break, uh, and I don't know why there was a big break, but we did have a big break. Oh, but here we go. This is where things are going to go. Sheer, oh, yeah. Just the sheer passive aggression of me. Oh, I've got a beer, have you? <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had the keypad just to skip back five seconds. <laughs> Whoa, was that noise? Got a beer. Got a beer. Lovely. Times are tough. <laughs> mm. Speaking of tough, there's some wrestling. Oh, oh. hey! Oh. What was wrong with that? Boo. Right, well, you, you Matthew know. heard that segue and thought, aha, there's a market there. <laughs> <for me." laughs> we write this down on this bit of paper. We'll go, oh, I haven't got any pens because we're cheap. Uh, I'm you, there. Who go on. Uh, Raw, the 24 and 50 week. Yeah, that was. What was that? <laughs> How is that, that was left in? in. How is that allowed in? That was left in. We can't leave that in on this. We can have it. What do we do? What do we do now? What do we do here? Can you just can you just <laughs> mute it when he says it? That's been done. So that video is getting demonetized. Even the YouTube person has to check if the swear word. Ah, forget it. Oh, oh Rose again with this. You're right. Right. Awful. Raw was on Monday night. Raw was on. <laughs> Monday night Raw was on. I'm actually Monday, excited to hear what happened on Raw. And the notes we have, as I look like, I'm not looking at my notes. There we go. Do this. Uh, Braun Strowman <laughs> pulled down a thing. Not interesting. Oh, sorry, <laughs> I've wrote, I wrote some of these and I should have made that more clear. Braun Strowman pulled down a thing onto. Wait, that's all it was. Was a thing. It was a big. I mean, it was a thing. It didn't. It wasn't. Not Lesnar. Wow, I've had a beer. A thing. It was. Uh, <laughs> it was like a big scaffold thing. thing he just, just pulled it down on Lesnar with his hook. It was. Oh, oh, yeah. he, 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 he fell on uh, Kane and Lesnar. It was now debuted in AEW. Doing anything. The colours changed. Yeah, there's no white balancing in this. Interesting. Between the three cameras, which is shoddy. It was saying it was a lighting rig. Change of progress wrestling. It was the Saddam statue. From 2003. Wow. Um, what a reference. Oh, it's like in Cultaholics uh, Punk Rock yeah, too. And again, yeah. the, yeah. these things Electric happen with, with 
Kane and uh, especially Braun Strowman now, and I don't even bat an eyelid. Do you remember this in the build? Like, oh, the the build is way too close to the edge of the table for my life. <laughs> Shaky table. The, the build up the Braun, Rumble 2018. Uh, I do remember Kane, Lesnar, and yeah, Strowman. It was a grappling hook. Gra- yeah. was, it, was it a grappling hook? That's what they called yes. it. I had enough. I was a, a grapple hook. hook. I thought. I think I'm, he's got a toy coming out with that as an accessory. I read it before I watched it, and I misread, or just my brain just first of all read it as this like repel. So I assumed I thought he was going to be like Bond, just like with the thing on his wrist. And like badged it down, but he didn't. Yeah, Kane and Lesnar driving away, going, "You'll never catch us." He goes, <laughs> "Oh <good>. yeah, <laughs> no." Nah. Uh, We've yeah, done well. It was an interesting segment. That's some good podcasting. I, I still, swear, I must be on some dodgy site where people go. If you want to see what British oh, people's oh, teeth look like, but it's Prince Creed. Oh, really oh yeah, Stop it. Kane. Look at you now. I got tin cannon. Look at you now. He's never getting the same. No, the Browner. Was that your Kane impression? Kane is not winning. Oh, Silence! Die dead, dead inside! See, that's not your fault. That's our fault. I'll you went for it. Child I and we weren't really there for you. Uh, it's, it's so great. Do a cane nice impression. Do a cane impression. I'm scared, scared of watching yeah, myself. We, we, that's we from the Bettini <laughs> line of, we like, you to do we're it. the alpha males, yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> like the Kevin uh, Nash in this build, Matthew. I'm we, definitely not you. the alpha male. You see how many times I've touched my face? and uh, I know I do that now anyway. I'm really fidgety, but I'm clearly in distress during this. I don't know why. You've ever seen those videos of, like... POWs with a blinking SOS. I am fine. <laughs> yeah. Everything is cool. Someone once did a. Someone once tweeted me a screenshot from a video I was in of every time I touched my face in the video, and it was like really. Oh, it was nasty. I felt Aww. sad. It made me feel sad when he did it. But I thought that's some effort, though. <laughs> to be fair. Yeah. No, it was nasty. It's a fine line between hatred and love, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to think. It made me reevaluate myself. <laughs> hey. <laughs> No, I, I, he's got his place and whatever. But it's it's the Royal Rumble, so it's rare for a title to change hands. So it's like the let's just build time until WrestleMania season kicks in and the real storyline wasn't happens. It Le- wasn't it Lesnar who wrestled Bob Holly at a, a Royal Rumble? And yeah, Bob it was. Uh, yeah, out of Bob, revenge. Bob Holly for, broke. Yeah. yeah, I was going to say. Well, I'm sure Bob Holly tells it that way. Ne- yeah, big swing of that beer. I think I've forgotten. I'm on a podcast here. I think I'm down the pub. Oh, <laughs> Bob Holly sandbagged Brock Lesnar, and Bob Holly was like. Why would I do that? Why would I want a sandbag brought like, And how do you think also, I do that? No, it's yeah, good, it's true. Brought, like, yeah. Yeah. If you like, hey, you, you know the thing we were talking about? So it's something time, different. It's the wrong guy to be doing it with. And yeah. I kind of like... I like Bob Holly, but come on. I, I kind of like funny little... I like Bob Holly, but... Royal Rumble title matches. It's a nice quirk of the what pay-per-view, I think. Quite enjoy them. I still yeah, do. I mean, sometimes it can be like Umaga versus John Cena and be amazing. Yeah, I still like Cena. Um, yeah, Cena matches. versus AJ Styles last year. Yeah. <laughs> the last <laughs> triple threat in the Royal Rumble was Tota Mays Bowles. Oh, 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 Phoenix Splash. Oh. Hasn't hit it once. Ah, uh, he hit a mania <laughs> on Triple H. Second oh, God, time I've did. mentioned that match in this podcast yes, after okay. Triple H's entrance. How dare you Lo- put out my mistakes? No, Love that entrance. God. <laughs> wow. So good. So that happened. You uh, just. I'm like, you just went. Oh. Which is Ross was his, he had two mouths. Trademarks now the club, the club, or yeah. a club. <laughs> yes. There are other clubs available um, of Finn Balor, orange, uh, minty, fruit and nut, fruit and nut, <sighs> plain. God. Yes. If you like a lot of chocolate on your biscuit, join our club. Join the ballot. Wait, wait a minute. Now then, hang on. Now ah. then. Hang on. Wait a minute. That's the second thing Matthews latched on that Jack did first. No. Crappy segues. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, if you're going to steal, steal from the best. <laughs> I had no idea. Wow. But it's not until months after this, though, isn't it? I've got no idea. Well, oh. well I'll tell you what we should do as well. We'll watch the see, start see of week the two. First time. Yeah, yeah, see the first time I do that, and your, everyone's reaction is just, wait, 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 <laughs> what? What did you just say? We should watch the start of week twos as well, just to see no, what please, changed no, from week please, to week. Please, yeah, please. I've got to, we're going to do that. I agree with that. Join the club. The club. And... <laughs> They've got a thing where they're smiling a lot. I've never been so much like my he's dad. Like, he's off his tits the entire time, Balor, isn't he? He's thinking about Lego. <laughs> it's like, it's like, yeah, right. It's about like, okay. Is Lego? it him being a bit healy? Does he what? Like, does Balor okay, like Lego? I hate WWE when you watch it and go, so oh, he just like, always thinks about Lego. He's a big Lego fan. That's a January 2018 bit, <laughs> Oh, he's getting a bit cocky. Oh, man. Uh, right. It's him, Gallows and Anderson. And they, they were like the cool kids. Picking on poor Jason Jordan, who Jason Jordan is a nerd and screamed no, it in his play. face. Actually, he's a producer, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, he is. a, tense, a tense moment Ooh. that one. Was it? Did you podcast? Balor's like, oh. what's the uh, where, what's the word we used to describe Jason Jordan? I know. Oh god! Oh. And there, whoa! whoa. <laughs> I thought that was a good idea. 
Yeah, what? I didn't even Jesus. realize. Oh, I know what you're referring to. Yeah, yeah, but we'll just. Oh my uh, goodness. Nincompoop. We weren't. That wasn't our own thoughts. We <laughs> were, no, that's what everyone else was thinking. We were lampooning. Yeah, but nowadays we just leave that segment to well Cheers. alone. Back the back the back the back. How we just talk over that? Quite far through the video. Seems like we're I don't mean in a negative way. I don't think it was the good. only one. The AJ Styles Roman Reigns <laughs> feud. Every they segment had, is another right one. After Mania, another. which was the best Roman Reigns has looked oh. since this run. Um, where, yeah, oh. they were both being cool, but like, all right, if you're a dick, I'll be a dick to you, but I'm not going to be the first guy to be a dick. Yeah. So it was, you know, Styles with his club, and then Reigns with the Usos. Mm. Oh, I remember that. Um, wow. Yeah, it seems like they do the same thing. Idea. Jason Jordan, after months yeah. of being. Like, oh, what is happening with this? Has <laughs> finally found a bit of a niche as uh, being mini Kurt Angle from 2000. Was this around the time he's he... the one going, Come on, guys! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> was this before <laughs> after the. No, this was after <laughs> the Sun storyline, wasn't it? Oh, yeah, it was yeah, he was, he was doing the thing with the shield. Which <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> was this around the time he was throwing fruit and veggie people? Yeah. And I think I just wanted to was Elias, wasn't like it? That. Yes, I'm happy to Was he throwing it at Elias? He's like, Get some stuff. He's like, I got you the latest in gaming technology and it's Game Boy Advances <laughs> or something. It's like, oh, hey, there oh, we go. Yes. First game. Oh, I love that. I love that one. <laughs> it's like that until I realised I think I'm the Jason like Jordan of this club, this setup that we have here. No, I think it's me. I genuinely think I'm no, the No, the people Jordan. like you. So mm. <laughs> they didn't. Mm. G- oh, Bajini joining the in. Great what, what did he speaks. say? He went. He just <laughs> said it's a bit like yeah. me, and I said no, but people like yeah, you. Yeah. So Bajini laughed dramatically. No, people don't know. He's like, I got you the latest in gaming I want technology. I want to hear how malicious this stuff was, actually. <laughs> <or something. laughs> it's like, uh, uh, yeah, I like, and I, I, I was liking that until I realised I think I'm the Jason Jordan of this club, this setup that we have here. No, I think it's me. I genuinely think I'm no, the No, but Jason people Jordan. like you. So, mm. <laughs> wow, Jesus. Oh, that hey, was nasty, that as well. There you go, I proved a point there. People like you. That's just, that's just, that's just, <laughs> oh, no comeback oh, at all oh, as well. The pocket sets it off. Mm-hmm. Uh, hmm. Samoa Joe, injured, question mark, intrigue. Well, is it real? Or is he taking time out of film? Is, it's it's, it's his... coincidentally the same amount of filming? time he's injured and to recover. Did that commercial? Exactly the same length as this mix. And he buggered uh, himself up. MMC, I think. Oh, the... Yes, Mixed Match Challenge. Yes, Mixed Match Challenge. It's weird, though, because like, he's really part of this new Transformers thing. Oh, he's oh, oh, new Transformers thing. Samoa Joe's in that. You did voice over. Ross said so, so yeah. He was one of the baddies. I don't know, it remains to be seen. However, I do hope we still get John Cena versus Joe at yeah. the Rumble. And we never did. I did never some did, research no. on, um, on the Transformers series. My God. Yeah, because I'm not familiar with the Transformers universe at all. Um, he's going to play Matthew's eyes light up, because it's an old thing from the 80s. He can bore us with stories. Sounds tough. And <laughs> he laughed at Freddie King. And, um, sounds, again, I'm not no, no, everything no. you're saying, Jack. In a sound, nice way. In a nice way. Um, and he's and he's gonna be like the leader of a group of probably robots, I guess. You know what I mean? <laughs> this is a great research. Uh, uh, yeah, so so robots, you're saying what the film is about. <laughs> to be yeah. honest, right? I didn't. I, so well, they, oh, Ross is, power is uncomfortable. Yeah, yeah. My power range with people. Ross has no hard. input to this conversation no, no, at no, all. No, no, no. Yeah. Yeah. I, I know about power. power I know about power. <laughs> power <laughs> yeah, I want to transform into a car so I can yeah, drive yeah, away power from power this. Our bits of like. I love power range. Off topic. Like our tangents seem like pre planned. Like, and now we'll talk for two minutes about another thing. I can tell from your face that that's true. I'm going to try and extend it to that limit. Yellow one and the red one. Not the names. Speaking of the yellow one, a nice yellow hue has appeared on this camera. Yeah, someone's saying cars. So you've got jaundice there, Matthew. I'm going to get an ulcer just listening to this. I think my favorite one was. Don't be a nerd. Wasn't the green one the cool one? You knew. You're there, you went. Don't be a nerd, Matthew. You scolded yourself. I'm fine with this. <laughs> Who's your favourite Power Ranger? Is um, it Tommy, the red that... one? I knew that Tommy was the red one, didn't he? Yes. No? Oh, it's all right. Oh, it's no, comedy Power Ranger, obviously. Oh, uh, okay. No, I can't have a favourite Power Ranger. All the other Power Rangers get jealous. <laughs> so, okay. that's good save. Um, <laughs> yeah, uh, also Transformers series, Trent Seven. What? A dry eye in the house. And Wolfgang. Start, start again, what? They were in a film. Yeah, they were in the... Uh, the camera's not centred, is it? I listened to your podcast, no. Jim Swan was well, talking about... was like, the way he was when working, you'd think he had to like he wind it up. <laughs> the fact that he was behind, Hi, like, friends. We've been shuffling oh, around well, so much. That's though. really good. I was just went. Who was it? Who came out and did a heel promo and like and did a Jim Swan impression? It was very funny. I think it was Nathan Cruz. I think he got the mic and went, "Hello, my friends." It wouldn't sound Isn't like Isn't it? Man, heard off like, oh. like, oh. Give me a cheers. Oh, yeah. You first got the holic. Who did he do an impression of? <laughs> it's your round. It's Jim um, Smallman. 
No, um, I heard I a small no interview people. in Trent Seven, mm -hmm. and he asked, he told us. Why are we talking about British wrestling now? British wrestling was big at the time. Someone oh yeah, yeah it's still big. Also, like a stuntman or something. So yeah, it's still big at the time. I thought you went. I thought you were still big. I was going to be like, the earth's been salted. So the guy came around and was like, "Have you planned something out?" And they were like, "Whatever." And then just did a really good one because. Because that's their job. Oh, I think they gave him Frankenstein. Oh yeah, that's Trent Seven story. <laughs> but, yeah, like, well, I told Tom that story as well. So literally like Facebook two weeks ago. Oh, so and so and so and so. Like, I've realised I've got five anecdotes. <laughs> yeah. Cycle through. So yeah, um, <coughs> Transformers was great when I was a kid. Oh. But I tried watching some of the <laughs> new ones. Dying. I'm like, oh, okay, I'm old. This right. is, uh, Thomas the Tank in it. They've completely murdered him. Have they murdered Thomas the Tank? Right. Since it's gone CGI, it's just not. The same. I'm still not happy about that. Like, Ringo's not on as well. He's still entering fan mail. Um, well, my, my mate's got a kid, so when we were playing around, has got like, YouTube and whatever. Yeah, and Peter yeah. Rabbit is a new thing. Peter Rabbit's a new thing? Uh, Peter Rabbit. Yeah, he's got a film coming out. This is the by, Ron uh, Smackdown, Rick. <laughs> yeah, because <laughs> Peter Rabbit. I had a Peter film about him when I was younger. Documentary. He fell on hard times. I'm just totally nonsense. What are you on about? Uh, yeah, so at least you said something, Ross. Yeah, well done. Yeah, he, he had, had a better documentary about, about Peter, Peter Rabbit. Rabbit. <laughs> no, it was a film, a cartoon film about Peter Rabbit. It was a whole Beatrix uh, Potman mm. series, if I remember correctly. Yeah, yeah. John Puddle Duck. Yeah. But Why are we I, I just. Yeah. Yeah. I wasn't yeah. talking about wrestling. I thought, well, maybe we'll back here. We Fox went and murdered Jemima's ex. That's right. Why are we talking about that? That's right. Why are we joining that? Oh, those are kids. Eggs are kids. No one explains that when you're a kid. Whenever somebody comes out, Michael Cole has shot their nickname. Yes. So, like, I know he does it a few times, but I've always been paying attention to the crowd noise. Roman Reigns comes out, and you hear. The big dog! <laughs> oh, the monitor's about to turn off. Right? <laughs> this is exciting. Boss time! Yeah, it's better than what we're talking about. Um, Add back to the action! Oh, yeah, I'm going to pause, <laughs> I'm going to pause this. We didn't miss anything. <laughs> Not too long left, come on. He could, does he still call Nakamura We're shit? just over halfway through. Wait, it's only on special Are we? Oh, shinners. Shit. Oh, oh yeah, yes. when Cole called on, shin. Nakamura on, shin, shin, that was and it. Stuck around. Was Survivor Series, wasn't it? I think. He just called it. Yeah, he got like a, the bar. He'll just shout it. Like, <laughs> like yeah, thanks, Cole. I love that. I love that. <laughs> like he's a I'm kid. In his like, oh, yeah. oh, I remember oh. his name. It's Kane. I mean, yeah. the demon. For what do we want him to do? He's good at his job, and he might look cool. It's buzzwords and plugging. And that's it. And then Pat yes, Martin became along. He did yeah. a good job, but he's... Yeah. Well in, Pat. Uh, I also like Smojo beating Rhino, which was Marky Mack between 2005. Did you? Why is that? His voice that he does when it's the opening match. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> and, it's a, a point, yeah. and it's a sidewalk slam. <laughs> Just don't like that. I think it's, it's good getting Pat in little spurts. Yes. What? Yes. I said what I said. Oh, right, fair enough. Yeah. But a lot of Pat. Too much Pat. I'll have it's all almost the part I can get. Him and really? Michael Cole are refreshing on the commentary for me. Ah. Oof. You have that full pat milk? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's all better now. <laughs> Say something quick, make a point, and then move on. <laughs> you know what? How you know how milk was invented in the 1900s? Shut it up. comes from cows. I met Jim Smallman once, and he was nice. Like, shut the fuck up. The thing about pasteurization is... <laughs> you ever stuck one of the, the, the milking devices on, on your nipple? Yeah. Oh, yeah, hell, I remember mate. when you were a kid and you drank milk. Yeah. <laughs> That's what this is. And then, no, wait, wait, more silence. Looking around. Ross, Jack, Jack uh, coughs. Ross gets a beer. Ross drinks more. Yeah, there we go. And he says, <laughs> it doesn't mean that his loss to Roman Reigns last week, and what was a very good match, uh, doesn't mean anything because he's already taken years off Roman Reigns' career and he's still standing. Mm. It's like, okay. And then he threatens Cena. And uh, also the club that really took over Japan for a number of years, which is going to look great on is a T-shirt, by the Did way. They say that? Yes, the club that really took over Japan. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. for a number of years. That's pretty funny. That's <laughs> and uh, other highlight of the Miz Taraj beating up Reigns. The Miz Taraj uh, after Booker T said Who was Jason that? Jordan, Bo was Dallas, and Axel. Dean Ambrose oh. and achieved more than him. Uh, <laughs> they said he's like man. the Swedish chef of the Muppets. No one knows what he's talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Which again, the only reason to watch Jason Jordan other than the fact that he's finally got this little wacky thing going on is like Booker T, because the commentators yeah. always go, So what do you think about Jason uh, Jordan? And oh my like god, Booker again? T ramble like 10 <laughs> minutes incoherently, then go, You said the complete opposite last week, and then <laughs> talk over him before he gets to defend himself. I, will, I, will I just don't want to be there, do I? <laughs> yeah, I know, Matthew, I'll watch the exact same show. Any names, but went, there was someone in the car oh, right. who is big in the conspiracy theories, and we all know this about him. Oh, <laughs> yes. I don't know who it is. Right. Um, and Pacheco is, in like a, he thinks he's being sneaky in like a tattoo. Yes. He goes, 
Let's talk about conspiracy theories. Anyone got any big conspiracy theories? Jack? Go to me first. And I go, no, I don't really know much about conspiracy theories. I was like, all right, okay. You? Like, they're this person. And it just, like, he tried to, like, class. go straight ahead. It was really like, funny. Me first to, like, divert the... It was very funny. What a oh, dick. man, I've just said exactly what it... <laughs> but it was, though. Uh, but these good conspiracy theories are, like... Everyone got involved. It sort of broke down. It wasn't like letting Booker T ramble too much, really, sadly. But never mind. Broken Matt Hardy has his new theme. Thoughts? Thank you, Ross. Ooh. Yeah, move along. Getting Just like I'm criticising him for slower and doing that out. something with Woken Matt it's Hardy. Sad how oh, he's, he's, he's half pregnant. Do the thing of like, there's one thing you can do. Let's just. That's the only thing you can do. He can laugh. laugh. It's like he laughs at Bray Wyatt and the crowd's all hyped. Something's going like to happen. TNA, and it cuts the break. I hate this criticising something for not like being very Bobby good. Fight in the ring in and this. he had a box and a kangaroo. He didn't know what was coming <coughs> next. This time, laughter. This is right. Would it come out to say, like, with things, you can't be half pregnant. Hey! Yeah. You don't. You can't be well, half pregnant. Well, this is it. Right this now. is the comedy <laughs> peak of the <laughs> thing. <laughs> this is worth you putting in the title. This was the right best. Now, this was the Hardy. best Woken, bit. Hardy. Don't say broken. Woken Matt Hardy mm. is. <laughs> was this the best bit? Uh, whether or not he'll incubate that, some that more might, remains to be, be seen. That might be the episode title. Woken Matt Hardy is. Oh, it's my fault. But there was the interesting picture. And still everything from you. Of him with the guys from Anthem. Because they've oh, settled yeah, the lawsuit. Settled it. So it's like, it's like a, hey, yeah. like, wait a minute. Like, well, weren't you guys? Oh, whatever. So Was that on the Harris Brothers? Lost one. No, oh, that, that was... <laughs> No, no, they had the lawsuit with together. Anthem and they got oh, settled. And then, yeah, they had the Anthem yeah, yeah, thing. Yeah, then the people taking the, like, Mark selfies with them. Mm. Uh, that was so I cared about it. You can tell the passion I showed there. Else, anyone else say anything? There was so many sides to that. No, Smackdown. Sorry for preparing these rubbish notes when you've got really good ones. Oh, I don't need to brag. I'm a you wrote, you wrote, you wrote the notes for this week in wrestling. And then hate on it. Owens and Zayn got screwed by Shane again. Yeah. As we... See, I like the storyline with... Shame at Mark, probably actually explained it more, it'd be better. So it was a three on two handicap match, because it's going to be a handicap match for the title at Royal Rumble. And Shane Man made it Nakamura, uh, Naki to call, she Shinny, calls him. Shinny, 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 Shinny me pal, <laughs> uh, Orton, me brother, and uh, AJ Orton. Styles, War Alan. Matthew. War. Oh, oh, rule of three, uh, kind of. Calls done. Mates versus uh, I like Kevin you do Owens it. and Sami Zayn. The yep movement. If I could go mm. back, I would have let you I do hope, that. I hope they get rid of that. And it was, and, bro, yeah, it was a handicap match, and they a started people a bit. Have asked me, and Matthew, like, nah, is English your first language? And try to get counted out. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's podcast like no, this. It's no count out no, rules. Why? That's go, right, Matthew, apparently, I couldn't chair. listen to the no, podcast. It just kept on buffering whenever he was speaking. Oh, never mind. So it is... The storyline that is Shane McMahon getting more and more of a dick because he hates Owens and Zayn. He's getting he's more of a dick. Point, so he's gaining inches, is he? Oh, they did. They get more that dick. He loves his dad in the face. Like, right, but that, that's, that's what he says. He goes, wait a minute. The Daniel Bryan's like, well, you are the GM. You have to be fair. Mm. And she's like, no, I don't. Uh, my, my dad owns a company. Uh, so it's it's a it's a nice. Are you nervous? Story. You're talking over Jack. It's Do you think they're going to turn him heel? No, don't worry. I, I like it when we've been bit, talking all over each know, other. Not this. quite. It's it's really bad. sad to okay. see. You have to make a decision. And we were the two who knew each other. Because hey, I'm a baby from '98. Well, we got my shoes. He already is heel for me. Yeah, some people can boo him for the right reasons or yeah. cheer him because it's like, well, yeah, he did hit his dad. Yeah, forget about that though. It's just wrestling. <laughs> <laughs> Step in the ring like this. Yeah, it's not it's not ballet, is it? That's what they say. They do say that you don't every see week. Nottingham Ballet. Yeah, I guess. Do you? <laughs> you might see a I've theatrical. I've that. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Take a swan dive. Yeah. Yeah. No, no. Um, <laughs> Ross did a good yeah, line. No, I'm like, oh. is, though, is that back to the beer bowl. <laughs> <laughs> like Nakamura or and AJ Styles nice. are just like, okay, let's wait for our cue, and that's it. They're not doing anything. It, it takes is part a of lot. this. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, well, the rest of the show. If was, we were like. Rusev getting rolled up by Fandango. Oh! Wow, really? Well, I am this, gutted. This is like, the fashion police were like the hottest thing on SmackDown, and now they're not anymore. They were. And now Rusev Day are the hottest Slam. thing on SmackDown, and now they've gone, now nah, we'll give the win to... It was weird. I mean, it is in the US title Wait, tournament, so you can say... The fashion right, police were the fine, hottest thing on SmackDown. Like the For a while, they had those great segments, fans, yeah. but then oh, it just uh, kept on going uh, with no rhyme or reason, Breeze, and then they lost to... Um, Tyler Breeze, Jesus. Tyler Breeze. Zach, Zach and, and Breeze Angle. Uh, <laughs> the oh, they, their Mojo. Their skits on SmackDown were great. Scribble face. And then they kept on... <laughs> <they're> like, <laughs> All right, now keep on doing it. Like, and they beat that horse till it was dead. Mm. Is that the biggest slap in the face you can get? Beat the horse till it was dead. That's the expression, Matthew. Well done. A dot-com show. Quarter of an hour left. 20 minutes. Yeah, right. That's where it all is now, isn't it? It's all on there, but nobody sees it. 
And then they're I'm interested they for the mailbag. The front to go, oh, this was on WWE.com. Like, all right, so you want me to get a TV subscription to watch this? The network to see the other bit, and I'll go go on WWE.com as well. If you go subscribe to YouTube and Facebook Watch, yeah, yeah. Twitch. No, they don't. Whoa, do, they don't twi- do Twitch, Twitch impact, reference. Impact, of, impact have started a Twitch thing. What was all they used to do back in the day? Twitch do Wrestle Circus and uh, that's around, WWE. and they do Triple Mania. What was the one Vince spunk like millions of pounds on that just stopped doing it? Tout. Oh, tout. 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 Oh yeah, tout, tout and Twitch. And then <laughs> Daniel, very different things. Daniel Bryan brought talking smack back on, 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 on tout. On tout. That was really funny. <laughs> oh, actually. Yeah. Yeah. On tout. It was very. Daniel funny. Bryan tweeted that. saying oh, like, "Don't worry, they've cancelled talking smack, so but I'll bring it back on tout." Uh, Danny Bryan was checked out a long time. He knew he couldn't be touched. Oh, was this before they were letting the, him wrestle the again? The big hog. The big hog. James Hellsworth. James There's like, like three people who've been stuck in the, the same airport so and the same flight's been delayed. Big hog. Other than a lift and the door just won't open. Yeah. Just blindsided by it. You've got to just talk or shag. Yeah. And they decide to talk. Not shag. No battery on the phone. Richard, is there any possibility you could get the haptics up? from this episode of the podcast and see how many people... I don't know what the right word is. The analytics. The analytics. When people stopped watching. Because get the, the, you get the retention rates, don't you? <laughs> see when people dropped off. Because that would be very interesting. I don't think anyone's watching 45 minutes in. I don't think anyone at all is watching There's 45 no way minutes in. Is that a possibility, Richard? Go on then. We'll continue watching and find out that as well. Right favorite, Adam Pacitti's literal favorite. And oh, he's not here. We could say anything about. Yeah, he loves Mojo Rawley. No, no, he is. No, no, he is his favorite, and he's his <laughs> real life. You real didn't life believe them as well. That's Adam's, yeah. whole, that's Adam's <laughs> whole thing. <laughs> they're just mates. They're just, just, just famous in the DM each other all the they're time. They're just pals. That's all. Mojo calls Adam my main man. <laughs> Pacitti calls him my big dog. He doesn't leave. <laughs> big dog. Big dog. So this is before when you called him Playboy. Wow. I find fantastic. They're fr- they're actual. I don't know. If, I don't think they've met. His Facebook profile photo was he him and Mojo, wasn't it? <laughs> he tried to meet him. He didn't quite get there though. <laughs> not, in the, not in a creepy. I can't remember. That was in reference to. He saw that Bacchetti had photoshopped all his pictures. Of him yeah. Yeah. Like, see, with the glint in my eye, there was a reference to something there. Mm. And he was just like, nah. Have you seen the Partridge episode where he walks in? He's in his <laughs> big fan's house and there's like in the room with all the pictures. <laughs> Have you seen that very famous yeah, scene, Matthew? Of it. It's just started, so it's just Have the eyes it? here. But it's, it's, it takes a long time to tattoo an entire face. Sorry, Adam. Adam quite likes... What do you mean? I thought it was just... Oh, it's no, not true? No, I'm just saying it for when he watches oh. this back. Um, Why was that left in, that curse? I can't believe that. I can't remember. It was obviously edited with the camera angles and stuff. Yeah. Because whoever was tasked with editing it obviously couldn't be bothered to sit through because oh. they'd just be like, oh. Or whoever was editing it had to contend with all of the camera angles and maybe got a bit overwhelmed and... The the the, the S H I T slipped through the net, both literally and figuratively. Yeah. Did you edit this Very one, nice. Richard? Mm-hmm. He was. Did you edit this one? We were here at this point. No, he wouldn't have let us slip wow. up like that. I think it was like a couple of weeks before I started. Where were you? Oh, he was. Never. Oh, oh, first defect. <coughs> defect. Defect. These this tinsels. Doing it's making same. me cough. Yeah, like it might be dusty. It might be because of the do- uh, you know the Christmas stuffs in the cupboard since you know previous Christmas. Yeah, dusty, dusty. He's loving it. K fave. Come on. Um, Do you think the camera's moving by itself? We're not that <laughs> yeah. good. Yeah. Not that good yet. <laughs> well, it. Ross, um, we sorry, did Mojo. get better. Oh, uh, yeah. No, Adam quite likes Mojo. By doing less. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, trying less. That's uh, He took on Zack Ryder again in a rematch of their Clash Ooh. of Champions uh, five star. Oh, go on then. Uh, was good. I enjoyed that. Mojo's new theme is great. I like it. Uh, yeah, I don't theme? like it, mate. You know, it oh, he had a good theme. Do you remember it? I remember that. A little bit. A little bit. Okay, then. We have yeah. the retention statistics. I don't know if Richard might flash this up on the screen in the post-edit as well. But it goes down significantly, literally. <laughs> <laughs> Five minutes <laughs> in, maybe, is that? I don't know what the timer is at the bottom oh. there. Average view duration, this is per viewer, I assume, is seven, <laughs> 17 minutes, 13 seconds. <laughs> and yes... It's like a slalom. Mm. Now, to be fair, once once it's gotten down to sort of like... It's fairly consistent. 35%, those who are in it are in it for the long haul. They yeah. know what they like. And for some reason, God bless you, they liked us. By yeah. the end of the podcast, there's roughly 22, 23% watching, maybe a bit less than that. That's that, honestly, that started. That's not as bad as I thought. No, me neither. That's way stronger than it wow. had any right to be. Wow, been single figures. Like yeah. this, this, this shows, this should have been... Probably didn't look at it at the time, but this should have been a pat on the back, a reassurance. Don't worry, guys. There are people who wouldn't support you, no matter what crap you put out. <laughs> Does that thing on the yeah, bird, bird, bird song? Yeah. <laughs> uh, That's they, really pleasant. 
And I think he's got a good look now that he's bad because he is, you know, like he's five hour energy he's build. Big shaven head jock man, right. yeah. And Slam! The negative thing is him in the ring and on the commentary, <laughs> the shouting about, he's got the killer instinct. He's got this, like, he, he doesn't, though. Well, he's not sure. because of. How pronounced well, it's, it's, a it's a good <laughs> so match. Only, like, yeah. It's a bit like bang, saying. now the match is over. I yeah, kind of like get that. what they're going for, but I think you're right. They could emphasize different parts of his persona. Yeah, yeah. It's just when you notice that they're trying to force something down your throat, yeah, so yeah. to speak. That wow. it's, it's really. I mean, come on. Wow. Was there a need for the low hanging fruit? Oh, double man. entendre. Did he call me? <laughs> um, so yeah, that was our, uh, uh, other things that happened on SmackDown, the Riot Ross Squad. Uh, I smiled faintly. Riot, mm. Riot Squad, lost to the returning Becky Lynch. <laughs> the Riot Squad have done not much since joining SmackDown. Lost quite a bit. Yeah, they've. whereas Paige and Absolution, this big deal, oh my god, they're back. Uh, Paige like, and Absolution. Just, well, we'll Absolution. So, um, what's he called? He writes for Uprock. Brandon Stroud. Oh! oh. 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 Shiver me timbers! <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, Press the bad reference button! Uh, no, that's, that's it's fine, it was three years ago, we didn't know what was coming. Never mind. That was good. What do you mean? That's, that's what people who, wasn't like, Pokemon. Were, people no. who weren't watching Power Rangers play Pokemon Blue and Red. So. No, like you could get one of no. two Pokemon games. Um, oh, do you, you not have to explain a joke, don't we? Oh, oh, God. No, I'm explaining Ross. No, but I'm shocked as well. I'm explaining what he does now. I thought there was like four Pokemon. Yeah, but the first two. Well, red and this isn't. I was all about Donkey Kong. Me on the things, Game Boy. Slightly different things on each one. Mm. Hence, Absolution. And that the game, squad. the wrestling mm. game, where you were Triple H and Stone Cold, you had to fight to save right. Stephanie. Oh, oh what was yes. it? Light rubbish. Uh, <laughs> but the old <laughs> betrayal. betrayal. And Chad Gable came to the ring. I like Gable's American as Jesus. What's going on? There's the bell. Still as loud to this day. Yeah, you probably haven't moved. Right, right. Anyway. Uh, that was left Chad in. and Sheldon to yeah. are now very solid. You couldn't get rid of that fight content just because of a bell. <laughs> yeah, the title was won, and then Daniel Bryan yeah. said, no, 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 no. You can't no, recreate no, this lightning. So. Yes, director Ed Wood. Turned it over, and then so. Daniel Bryan came out and said, no, no, the referee's decision was final. Yeah. Everyone went, no, it wasn't. The referee came out with <laughs> like, the complete opposite to final. Well, I disagree. Lied, and he said, oh, Nothing. the referee went to the back. He thought, oh, I've made a mistake. Then he came back out. Oh, that's not what happened at all. That never happens yeah. in wrestling. The second referee came out. And that never happens yeah. in wrestling as well. The referee's decision is yeah, final. It's... Otherwise, heels would never win. Right, that annoys me yeah, to this no. day where they just, oh. every few yeah. months, go, oh, we'll do this this one time. And, uh, and then ignore the rest of them. He. not. What do you want us to do? Beat them twice? And Daniel Ryan went, Mm. That's a great idea. Which is like, all right, but that's exactly how they did the handicap match thing for the Royal Rumble. It's like, what do you want me to do? Wrestle them both at the same time? It might as well be a handicap match. And I'm Brian's like, my God, I'm the smartest guy in wrestling. Me. Have you noticed? That's that a when, great idea for the like. Oh. Have you noticed that when TLC comes up or when Money in the Bank comes up or something, <laughs> yeah, everyone yeah. always talk about like, you know, what, I really need to climb this ladder to success. And they're always like, well, it's funny you should say that because you'll get an opportunity. Or even yeah, worse, it's like, oh, we need a chair yeah. match. It's like randomly Baron Corbin's like, might not be chair. my original yeah. point. Wow, you should have a chair yeah. match at TLC. A ring steps match. It, it, yeah. Oh. What's so coming? Who's coming? Oh. It's the next segment. The mailbag. Oh. And now it's time for our... another abrupt ending. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> someone, else, someone literally them. just walked in. Now it's time for our favourite part of the show. Certainly. <laughs> Certainly. Talk Still to is. the audience. Mailbag. With the mailbag. A bag of I'm mails. Rushing. I want to be done. You too can be in the mailbag section. Not literally, but in spirit. Like the end of Return of the Jedi. We'll, oh. sti- we'll like talk about like Matt Stryker. Like, like the end of Return of the Jedi. Will Steven Scudez be in the first ever mailbag? Oh, you want to I hope Steven so. Scudez just has like, the first comment underneath the video. Just says, "This guy, this sucks." <laughs> Not even I watch By this. By sending your emails to mailbag at cultaholic.com. First time. You read it out there. <laughs> all right, all right. Or read YouTube comments, which and no one wants that. So here's our first one. Oh, I picked out the bag. Like that, you can see it's real. Uh, Tom in Worcestershire. Worcestershire, England. <laughs> Where's Campbell from? <laughs> Uh, is he from Worcestershire? No. He's from. <laughs> he's from Birmingham. You Where's... know what? I think he is from Worcestershire. I think he's from outside of the West Midlands. Just so could yeah. you imagine if the first ever mailbag question was from Tom Campbell? I'm gonna find out where. You know <laughs> that what? Would be funny. You know what? He said he used to watch back in the day. He'd, he'd sit in a coffee he's shop. He's a liar. <laughs> he's a good liar. Wait, wait. Hey sorry, guys. pause again. Intra- right. I'll if I find. Tom's, if I find Birmingham, I can find where he's from. Is he from, no, he's from south of Birmingham, somewhere. Is he from there? Or is he from Walsall, maybe? 
<laughs> Look, I don't know where Tom's from, right? <laughs> the new feature of the <laughs> podcast, Jack. Could Reed. it be a Wigan? Oh, Worcester. <laughs> Worcester. Eh? He's from Worcester itself. My God. Dun, dun, dun. Look at this. This is Tom. Should we ask him? Is it Tom? Let's, Should let's, I message let's him see other questions. Go see on. If figure out just from the I'll question. Give, I'll give him a message. Though, hey, right? guys, I'm really positive. <laughs> just to hear what you make of the all-in show that's being announced for September 1st. Where do you think it'll be held? Mm. Will it be good? <laughs> <laughs> what names do you think they'll attract? Attract? We've already answered this one. Papier? What names do you... I think Tom's well, having a bit of a think there. Uh, that's a good question, Tom from Worcestershire. 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 Tom. Good lad, good question. I don't know why you're from like Worcestershire. Yeah, yes. Um, be more specific. Very want your address, that, Tom? If we want to come pay you a visit. Where what, do we go? What room of the house do we visit? Wow. Why are these windows cars? open? Looking forward to all in actually. I think it's gonna be a good show. I am also excited <laughs> for this. Thing. <laughs> <laughs> Every time there's a clunk. Of... <laughs> Tom, the young book star, who lives in Worcester. All right. Yeah, the all-in show looks very interesting uh, because they want to do ten thousand. Yes, people. seats. And nobody outside of... Oh, is it WC, did TNA... No, TNA did it in the UK. In America, nobody's done it <coughs> since WCW. Right. Apart from WE, obviously. Uh, so, yeah, it would be interesting to see if they kind of... I mean, I'll, I'll like, yay, go do it, yeah. I'm not Thomas typing. There, but I'm going to be there in spirit. But if it is over there... Oh, he's put it wasn't him. London, but I don't think it wasn't him. No. no. It's it wasn't him. Go, should WrestleMania be in London or the UK or whatever like that? I'm like... If it's more profitable to do it here than it is over there, yeah, that's where they'll go mm. to. People, are, cities line up to pay the way to come to the places. It's not yeah, the reason. Yeah. Go, where should we go? And where's good this time of year? They go, you know, it's like who's going to give them the most amount of yeah. money? So. What's that noise? Yeah, but, yeah. Oh, I just wish it was more. I just wish it was more the other day. <laughs> wish it was more magical, less businessy. No, you know. What? WWE selection of wrestling. There's something scratching on the table, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. Like a yeah, well, just want it the out. world to be different, right? Yeah. That's all I want. Uh, we, all, we, all, we all want change. Yeah. <laughs> so what is that noise? What is that noise? Somewhere near us. Is it my zip? Yeah, get in. Oh, yeah, side. I might be hitting it with my yes, ball. Yes, get in the riverside. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> the O2 Academy. Newcastle upon time. No, yes. I think it'll be Chicago. Or Philadelphia, one of the two. Twelve minutes to go, lads. Wrestling Twelve wise. minutes to go. Come on. Lad. Yeah, Philly, hot beds. Yeah, Philly doesn't really have that wrestling scene it used to, like O2, because oh, actually maybe Ring of Honor still run there. Who knows? Yeah. Mention um, Caesar. Yeah. Chikara. Chikara. Yeah, oh, no. No. But yeah, Chicago, because then people can go home. Oh, like, but then people yeah. can make lots of money by going. Will CM Punk be there? Yeah. Chicago. Yeah. Well, it's ah, funny you should well, say that. that. Then, if it, yeah. then if it's then if it's in Chicago, if you love and, and CM Punk speculation, will, then you love the other episodes of the podcast. So maybe they'll not go Chicago just oh, to then. avoid that whole. Because if they announce Chicago instantly, everyone will go CM Punk's coming. Mm. Another That's interesting thing is they're running yeah. uh, Los Angeles weekend. was in Chicago. Oh, no they going to Los Angeles weekend? weekend. Yeah. Well, well, they, well, they oh, hoped he would, but they had so many other people announced. Apparently, all the rest of the people are people. Apparently, all the lads love it. Apparently, I've heard. I love it that Ricochet did an interview recently. He was just like, ah, oh, you know, I'm sick of wrestling bowler. I might not do it next year. And everyone around him going, all these wrestlers are dying to get in a bowl. And Ricochet's yeah. like, yeah, I'm sick of it. So The venue looks warm, looks hot. Oh, being there, it is, it is been? humid. He's very been there. humid. Of course, he's yeah, been a story the earlier on about his make it in Los Angeles. He has to go once <laughs> and go, wow, this is literally the <laughs> size of his room, pretty much, this, this famous arena. It's a shed. It's yeah. so unprofessional. It's nice. That's good. But so, yeah. so Speaking of beer like that, movie, it's so humid. Never on a podcast, that's fine. It's disgusting. No. Uh, so I recommend it. <laughs> Are you Lincoln? trying to muzzle uh, him? Uh, Sam <laughs> in Dallas, Texas. I've Not just been giving some terrible news. Dallas, I think. Uh, Dallas, <laughs> no. Yo, guys, a bit now. Ricochet maybe missing bowling. Like Dallas, 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 Salad. Yo guys, very excited about the new podcast. Well, I haven't seen it yet, mate. Simple question, really: Who will win the Royal Rumble? Women's and men's. So Matthew was blocking his sound Nakamura. there from the microphone. Sorry. Nakamura. Yeah, Ross. John. Huh. Johnny John. Big match, John. Really? That was Big the air. The air said he was going there up until the start of the kickoff show and went, whoop, he's not going to be there. Sorry. <laughs> Jesus, hold on. I thought it was the uh, Nakamura one. <laughs> this is? 2018. Johnny was there. No, he was in the man. Was he? Yeah, they did the whole old versus new stand Yeah. Was that 19 then when they said he wasn't going to be there? Maybe. Yeah, they did a bit where Cena stood in the middle of the ring and shouted. Yeah, that's the Shinsuke, no! This is who he's not The old guard versus the new school. Yes. And the new school, which is incredible, I think, now. Sorry, Joe. 
Yeah, it's not going to win, though. Yeah, and women's. Okay, that's in Russian. Um, Ronda. <laughs> it's going to happen, isn't it? They went for dead earlier the other night. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Do we sound like stalkers? They went for dinner. Ronda Rosie had dinner. <laughs> Oh, no, we you, saw her through the window. It, if you read it through TMZ, you're completely sane. If you go there mm. looking yourself, then you got to ask questions. Yeah. What about you, Jack? <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, oh, sorry. Christ. Man, what about you? On the Jack? board. <laughs> what about you again? Um, just... um, Can you skip back 10 seconds, Richard? Much easier TMZ. for you, Jack. Oh, don't sorry, don't Nakamura. Uh, sorry, men, uh, women's one. I've had... On the ball. Laughing at me again. Um, <laughs> I think. I wonder why he's Justin laughing. <laughs> I think um, I wanted to be Oscar, but I think it'd be Ronda. I'd like to. That was he. I'm I'm with think about uh, his mindset Oscar. while this was going on. Mo in London. Mo. His company London will not UK. last yeah. six months. No, because he Jim. didn't say or give any directions or advice. So it must be just thinking, this is going great. <laughs> Or network specials, as they're called now. <laughs> is the Rumble actually as good as people say, or is it yes. overrated? Savara series seems to provide more consistently good shows, in my opinion. <laughs> yeah, that'd be great. Yes, please. Because Fraser gave his thoughts. Question that's just yeah, that that like, no, yeah. Do you agree? <laughs> liar. He's a liar. I asked him, and he's been. Oh wait, he's Fraser though. He's, he's very, very dry. I'm very sarcastic. I'm just a, a piss taker at all yeah. hours of the day. You're right. Well, I'm, I can't believe I believed him. Yeah. He's awful. He needs to be stopped. He does. Sucks. No. Me and Fraser did a video once together. Yeah. Before he was officially a before he joined. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like it wouldn't be as awkward as this, but no. The cam goes. the camera is now on a slant. <laughs> not only is it not centered, but it appears that Jack's <laughs> sides higher up in it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why is the camera what? moving? Well, the stationary I'm camera. The stationary <laughs> camera. Look at, I'm glad that everyone had a nightmare, not just us. <laughs> Uh, the Rumble's the most special. No, well, WrestleMania is the biggest one, but the Rumble's the one that's like Christmas Good analysis for there. <laughs> like, it's the Rumble. What's gonna happen? <laughs> right, you can't hit the Rumble. I was also holding my yeah, it's what been, about, like, it's, microphone. I had this one on, I was. <laughs> None of us have got a, a way of putting a on a compromise. Oh, I was agreeing with you. Trying to make you think everything that you're thinking about. Uncle Dickhead. Yeah. Uh, Uncle Dickhead in 2014. Uncle Dickhead as well. Uncle Dickhead. I enjoyed 2017. Rumble. A lot of people did not. I didn't. Whatever. Personally, but yeah. But overall, Rumble. Absolutely. It's it's the one event. I'd say even more than WrestleMania that people who don't watch wrestling can enjoy. Because it's, it's, it's that be a bottle wobble on the tail, isn't it? Slash uh, wrestling match slash the floor is lava. Yeah. You can go, okay, you don't need to know who any of these people are. Just know if they land outside, they're eliminated. Yeah. So it's easy. It's very accessible for people. And <laughs> I watch it, I've watched more wrestling shows. This is the noise of a uh, man. Rumble shows that I have with non fans that have anything else. Uh, so yeah, I've not Rumble, absolutely not overrated. So oh, what's happening? I wanted to change the camera angle so much. Just have, I think. <laughs> Because my beer bottle's near and empty, it's become a lot lighter, so it's a lot more oh, jiggly on the table. I thought you were literally sat there like... Ah, I think so. Because <laughs> the table's shaking like a pooing dog. <laughs> it's right on the edge, so I hear it's that rattling in the background. In 95 and 96, it's... 2016? I really like the 2016 one. Actually, no, 2016's had that but then last really year's... good main event. Uh, oh, yeah, sorry, the Kevin Owens Goldberg. And AJ? No. no, that was, it was Goldberg Lesnar. Wait, what? Yes, Kevin Owens. That's what I meant. Uh... I'm pretty hungry. <laughs> yeah, no, sorry, that was uh, Fastlane. No, I meant, of course I meant Brock Lesnar and Goldberg. I thought the Survivor Series match. The match yes, that's what I meant. Survivor Series, uh, Raw versus really SmackDown. Oh. Yeah, they were really there good. We go. All three of those were good. But yes. then this year's... Mm, mm, yeah. It was just soothing Triple H's arse, wasn't it? Soothing his arse. Ooh. Ooh. I missed that. <laughs> you would like that. What? Oh, oh, I, didn't like, I didn't like right. the finish. Right. Right. I meant oh. Assassin. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> right. the Rumble. I like Rumble last year because I watched it in the casino, oh. and it was so nice because people were making so much noise for when Jack Allen came out with the umbrella. Oh. Hey. Hey. Can I run to the toilet really fast? Sorry. Of course you can. You don't have to come back. I'm talking a bit, bit pause there because we asked the boss, Adam El uh, General, Adam Pacini, what he thought of this. He replied, oh. "Quote: I thought we had made a mistake." I remember my ass clenching at various points because of how awkward it was. Oh. Thank you for giving us that direction uh, three years after the podcast. To be yeah. fair, though, saying this off camera as well, we spent literally an entire afternoon shooting that podcast. And the position we were in, there was no it, it, it had to go out. Yeah. It had to go out to try and make some money. And then it, it made $1.40. I'm not... 
going to give it any excuses. <laughs> no, no, you know what? It was as good as it could have been under the circumstance. Oh, sorry, it's not even finished yet. But we're oh, no, we're still done. Oh, it could have been a lot better. No, no, no. Yeah, I mean, standards be, that yeah. one. There we go. So the question that we're answering is, I've forgotten to have a little break there for everyone going to the toilet. What, what's the question we're answering? We'll find out. I don't uh, know. Just <laughs> the head around the door to see what was happening. Oh, uh, nice. Was it that? Was that? Oh, the rumble. Did I get that bigger, that bigger reaction. The, the umbrella. With us. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, yeah. just that Jack Gallagher was there. No. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, true. Was it? Do you think Pete Donovan in this one? I think Pete Donovan. Was in this he one. in this one? Yeah. Yeah, right. I didn't think about it until you said it. I think yeah, he, he should because actually he was, was no. But then he made his debut on Raw, didn't he, just before? Well, as like his nemesis. Nah, I think they'll leave I can't believe, he, I can't believe yeah, it. Yeah. It's all gone. And if Neville's going to return, still still that's going to be sure he just returns on it. If he doesn't return at Rumble, eh, who knows? Can Neville be in the Rumbles? Oh, no. Jack Gallagher's a cruiserweight. Oh. Cruiserweights aren't real wrestlers, are they? No, they're not going to WWE. Like Tamagotchi. Yes. Look after them. Whoa! Whoa! Would you rather? And now our closing segment. <laughs> this is Reese's. Oh, is this the initial oh, Reese's pieces before would Reese's you pieces rather? were the thing? I don't, I don't know, but I like the fact that they put that loud thing to wake you up. Do li- 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 <laughs> oh, I've got no idea what this is. <laughs> For two seconds, people Dom was in the Rumble 2019. Wait, or 2018, is and this... I have vague, vague memories of this not being very uh, good. What, what do you remember? I remember you saying something about Big Show's armpit. Me. I think I've got so. No recollection if it, if it is, if it does turn out to be that, um, go on. I'm not. I can't remember. Oh my god. Which we affectionately call "Would You Rather." Oh uh, yes. Pretty self-explanatory, to be honest with you. We all know it's bad. Jack, do you like have a Bob "Would You Rather"? I think this was because back in the day we did a uh, shag, marry, kill mm. in the previous life. Right. Ah, uh, uh, oh, uh, no, no, that's exactly. Sorry, it. St- yeah. I'll I'll correct myself there. Big Show's armpit was a Kenny Macintosh invention at the other place. I can hear, I can hear him saying it. Big Show's armpit. You'd rather Big put, your, put your head in Big Show's armpit, or he you... did, yeah, this is it, we just took this straight from Kenny. Q and A, Q and A with Big Show's armpit. This is, yeah. <laughs> this is different. This is di- totally different. Because cool. he gave he gave three options and we have two. Yes, massive. Oh, good. Would be awkward. Would you rather introduce your parents and have to convince them to let them stay for a week? Right, that's the situation here. Would you rather have what? as a guest for a week in your parents' house, right? Who? In character Boogeyman. Okay. Or in character Greg Valentine. I just started thinking about the most miserable. Greg Valentine. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> that, I've done. I've done. Rings, that was all right. That. High grade with him. <laughs> Does he skip back five seconds, which I can hear that. Cr- Miserable looking, like oh, the in ball. character Greg <laughs> Valentine because right. he brings the sweet high grade with him. Okay, oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, drugs yeah. are cool. That picture of Craig Valentine and Brutus the Barber Beefcake, you seen it? But they're both in an armchair, he's got the shirts off. Brutus has got his nipples pierced, <laughs> it's disgusting. But on the, <laughs> on, the, yeah, on the arm of the chair, is just Brutal. a massive old bong. Right, I think it is anyway. So, That's Greg would come round, yeah. Oh, my god, little Greg. Greg, uh, yeah, because we're thinking, well, it takes him a long time to get warmed up, famously, so by the time he, they've asked him hello, takes him a long time uh, to get warmed some up. days will pass. Takes Greg Valentine a long time to get warmed up. Fair enough. The joke Greg Valentine was always says, it takes uh, Greg Valentine 15 minutes to warm up, but who cares? What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. It's if relevant because I mentioned show, him, though. Yeah, but I'm trying to segue the only Greg Valentine thing I know about him. And it Would you rather lick the big show's left armpit? Or his white one. His right one. Well done, right Jack. One. Take a boo. Right Take a boo. Right right no. What's that got? Has he remembered left. this? That's How you, that's, you? That's, that's Big Show's right left right. armpit. Because or his right armpit. How have you See, nicked that from Kenny? I, right. I wasn't aware Kenny did it, I don't think. Maybe, maybe, maybe I never did those podcasts. Maybe I've totally like third guessed myself, not second guessed myself. My logic's complete flip reverse there. But similar lines. You couldn't be bothered, could you? You've that question in massively. Oh, doing an office, look at the camera. Oh, oh, oh. Collecting more. I think people hated that. It's a massive question, which I know Matthew takes a long time to think of. It's a huge answer, this. Oh, no, I don't need to think. I choose the gun. Uh, Thank you very much. Uh, Matthew's out of his funny little, line. Tiny. <laughs> He's had enough, Welcome Matthew has. He has, he has. Time like, to go home. It's time. one of the seconds. It's because I haven't got anything interesting or exciting to say. Lock the door. Wow, yeah, literally about to say the exact thing. Would you rather watch 
Look at the body language of all three of us. <laughs> Battlefield. Dolph Ziggler, 2017 promos. Wow, you're gonna have to give a bit of. I don't know what Battlefield Earth. Well, oh, give really? a brief. Give a brief. Give a I would brief. watch. <laughs> give a brief. Oh, really? Give a oh, brief oh, explanation yeah, of what it is. Um, just a plug for Battlefield Earth. No, I mean, you've all the things to plug. Matthew, uh, no, you it's, seem it's sad, one of the worst no. films of okay. all time. Uh, it's not just you. It's all three of us being rubbish. Because I was gonna say the room, but everyone loves the room, so it's not really a comparison. Um, I'm trying to be life. like, no, I know what I'm talking Son about. Of the Where's the smart crew? We all know what we're <laughs> no. doing because why else would you watch this show? And I'm realizing that's not what people recall. know. This well, is crazy. Well, analyze things. Three people I'd watch, having I'd a bit of a crack. None of that. Put this on in Dartmoor. All the prisoners will go back their cells. Great. Um, I wouldn't necessarily. I'm just not a big film guy, so I won't have seen it. So. Yeah, fair. Battlefield yeah. Earth. Something new oh, this is the worst first date. In the year 3000, there are no countries, no oh cities. Dear. Earth is on the Battlefield Earth Wikipedia page. It's an endangered species. This sounds excellent. Oh. That sounds really It's exciting. a Scientology film. Oh, basically. Right, okay, well. And it's even worse than what you're thinking of right now. Oh, let's not. Well, that, that was a. That well, that was great. Was I like that we ended on Battlefield Earth. How long was left? Two minutes. Come on. Pokemon Blue. To <laughs> just I I <laughs> Yes, we are on the cutting edge, and that's why we should be in front of a camera talking about wrestling. Yeah, man. And you're the sort of thing that we're doing as well. Here. That's another good quality first episode of Cult the Wrestling Video Podcast. Yeah, but I've you can laugh and say it's crap, but it's not yeah, that crap. Slow zoom out. Greg, don't follow me. All I tweet about is Jojo's bizarre adventure. Yeah, why? Oh, about Jojo. Why? Do you follow me because I'm insecure and I like followers? Ah, oh, fair enough. And Ross. At uh, Ross on wrestling, I am terribly lonely. Just <laughs> <laughs> are you for smiling us. politely. But you could be um, less lonely by following us on patreon.com forward slash cultahop. Where it. you can vote for um, oh, just the in. Hall of Fame. <laughs> the the Hall get it. Finally, the excitement. Like this. So, so, you're so good. Oh, I love Hall of Fame. There's one more thing we've got to mention mailbag. Yes, the uh, bag of mail. You can send your emails, ooh, your tweets, right. your death ooh. threats. Mailbag at cultaholic.com. I saw a cut there. Or oh, you can just tweet us. You can YouTube comment. Call us all horrible, horrible names. Uh, I don't think they will. I think <laughs> been a while. Horrible, horrible oh. names. Do you know what? Do you want to do our? Do you want to do our right. sign off? And do you want to say it all together? Do you want to do it? Oh, one more. Do one we have more, to? One more thing. Now I've got no recollection of this. Who came up with the sign off? The join us. Thing. Is it going to be the I same? I thought Bacini said it to do with the join us. Did, Did he? he? I swear, I swear I remember. That would make sense. Have we got a sign off? Yeah, it's just it's just join us. Just say join us on three. Because the cult. Join us on three. Yeah. Ready? One, are you going to say? Oh, are you going to say oh, join oh, us on three? three? There we go. Lovely. Oh. See you later. <laughs> I'm so off. Coming down. The he street. is. He's off. God. Well. We, we, oh. That feels more like like begging at that point after that podcast <laughs> yeah, of yeah, being drawn yeah, yeah. to Oh, man. Thank you. Thank you. God. Thank you. Professional presenters. Well, the cameraman laughs. That was one. Well, like, change the Instagram now as well, so don't follow that. What's this music? On the phone. Actually, remember that there? Ten Pop pages. Doing pages for the request that? release. That doesn't sound right. After WrestleMania. We oh, one it's, one a, it's a list. Um, we need to go back. Right. That's the that's the first episode of the podcast. Over the second, yeah, so we'll see how the second one starts. Just let, let's. Any how do how do we feel after watching? Really that? sad. I feel quite sad as well. I it, it's like a repressed memory because I remember it being awkward, and but you want to go. Yeah, but surely these things aren't as bad as you thought. No, it's every bit of yeah, that. That was worse than I remembered. It's it. worse. I yeah. don't remember it being anywhere near that bad. Yeah. That I didn't look bad. interested. I well, didn't. me and you, you can't do a podcast with a random person. You don't. No. Unless I'll interview and whatever. But like, if you do a podcast with three lads, it's supposed to be crack. People like the people talking about just stuff. And we had no direction, no real. So, are you doing this? I'm trying to be Angus Deaton. Like, I'm going to. Aha! Good line. Look at the camera. <clears throat> Look how smart I am. And I'll just. I'm suck. I'm just a bag, bag of suck. Yeah. You're drinking. <laughs> the beer bottle was, that was the, the highlight. Best bit. <laughs> Making those little noises. <laughs> it's it's head and head between that and Jack's cough. He's just coughed as I said that. I the tinsel this time. No, the problem is, the the yeah the highlight genuinely was Ross appearing with a beer bottle after the thumb after the thumbs up because it <laughs> fits me. <laughs> the disinterest really adds to that. Yeah. Shall we have a look at the comments and see what the comments made of the first ever we'll podcast? See what the, see what the, how the second one starts, and then look at the comments back. Or... Whatever you want to do, Matthew. I don't want to watch the second we'll one. Do, we'll look at the do comments second. Okay, we'll do the comments. We'll see the yeah, comments yeah. first, see if there's any suggestions, and then look at the, okay. the second podcast. Right, should, we then, read so... them, should we read them? Well, I'll start off. 
Uh, Lorenzo says, every now and then, I come back to this. Such a gem. That's 11 thumbs up. Gotta be so Nine okay. months ago. Yeah. Because it's so bad. Do you want to read the second one? Ross's New Japan run was amazing. I still remember his three out of five falls match with Shinsuke Nakamura. That ended in them crashing an ambulance. That's, 144 uh, likes. That was just an off comment from you, I think, near the start of the podcast about me being in New Japan. Yeah. They've really gone in the spirit of it, though, there. We have another well, comment. Because yeah. the six replies are to that. It's just like... Uh, I think you're mistaken. The oh, match was Na- uh, with Nakamura after his. It's just everyone's fantasy Suzuki, booking. Yeah. Come on now. Come yeah. On. Uh, yeah, no, okay, okay, yeah, 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 um, Cody the Punk 21. This is such a weird thing to watch a year plus later. Everything is so different and for the better. <laughs> yeah. Cheers. Bet there's a comment there. No, I preferred it this way. Oh, Pardon please. The... Try in 2021. Hey, yeah, yeah, it's very true. Good advice. Very true. Jay, listen to the, the 100th episode today. Came back to see how awkward they were. <laughs> I love it. Eight likes. Then, oh, if you watch it ironically, same. I guess. And they, uh, does he mean to say they weren't or they were? Because And they were. They, they were that awkward. awkward. Oh, God, there's a swear there. 301. The legend that is Matthew from the land of Boss. Yeah, you're over, brother. He just stayed a legend. <laughs> After watching this, I'm genuinely surprised. They- <laughs> <laughs> As much uh, as I love the podcast, this wait, is a train can't, wreck. Can't wait for the watch along. Nine months Nine ago. Nine months ago. Yeah, we've been promised oh, yeah. this for no, ages. No, the first time we did this is because I booked something else, and then I woke right. up to my horror to see all this message going, so where were you? I'm like, oh, huh. I'm sorry. Aesop Twin, three years ago. Some constructive criticism. I would suggest sitting down for the yeah. next one. You guys yeah. seem a bit too uncomfortable standing up for an hour. Yes. Mm-hmm. Uh, also, don't be afraid, afraid to veer off topic. I Whoa. don't know. I don't know about that. Don't be afraid. Oh, we did. Into things other than pro wrestling. I'm sure you guys did We awesome did do that, but stories. we were visibly yeah. afraid of doing it as well. Oh, oh, there we go. And it would be cool to learn a bit more about you as people. Yes, we should have done that before we started doing this. Aside, no big ups to Matthew for Dallas Salad. Dallas. So I was to Dallas and I went salad, which is a reference to a video. Yeah, I can't uh, believe you referenced that. There you go, I, Josh. I Do you got that? Oh, I was wondering because it's Josh. Yeah, Josh Strange six Duh. months ago. Don't be a bit if you're off topic. Jeez, this age. Well, <laughs> uh, definitely love it now, don't they? Yeah, turn it around, UK pop culture podcast with a tiny bit of wrestling, yeah. and I love it. That's yeah, fair. fair enough. These are way, way more positive than I thought. Laura, this is amazing. I'm so excited to see Matthew fair as part oh, of. Oh, thank you, Laura. El Namaste. El Muchado. El Muchacho. Ab- El Muchacho, I can't see you. Absolutely love this. Can't wait for the next one. Oh, no. Next. Skip that one. Skip it. Uh-huh. No. Woohoo. <laughs> I've been hoping for this since the channel took off. Finally, a long, a long form, form discussion, discussion. With, of issues with the group. Thank <laughs> you so much. Wow. Matthew looks so much older in this one than the latest episode. That's good. <laughs> he looks older with short hair. Right, that, oh, look, we've all aged tremendously. Uh, saying that now. Oh, you Ross do. is like, how the yeah. <laughs> How do you have to end up here? <laughs> what, in his own company making money, talking about only wrestling? Yeah, terrible. Oh, man. you've been defended. Uh, uh, a white easy, knight, ba- a easy wh- baby girl. Don't get your niggas into a twist. <laughs> Just pointing out that your point is... Is at most, Whoa. no. X word. Ross has got a white knight. Aye. <laughs> Thank you very much. Get him. Uh, Virgil Joy. Wow, weekly podcast, yeah. awesome. Keep it up, guys, and maybe get some chairs to sit down <laughs> next time. It's kind of awkward, blah, blah, blah. Start watching the podcast again from the beginning just to see how many in the first one. <laughs> as soon as this goes on iTunes, I'll download every single episode. Got to support the cult. Thank you very much. I enjoyed this. They're not that bad, are this they? This video needs to be ball wrapped and put in a time capsule. I don't know how someone's explaining Power Rangers to me there. Oh, I just, just want to. Great podcast. Hope Matthew is in many more. To oh, come. wait, thank you. Whoa, Matthew, that's a pretty big get. <laughs> <laughs> Hope he comes around more. Uh, uh, really forms like a warm natter. With a the warm lads. natter. I think yeah, it was ice cold. It was frigid. <laughs> warm natter. The good that is unreal. We agree. <laughs> <laughs> Do more of these. This very was actually really good. What I've learned is that the um, bar is so low, and and also there's so many many per- podcasts that are worse than this. And also and that's yeah. the thing. If people already like you, they'll lie. Yeah. They'll lie to make oh, you feel you get better. A lot more leeway if people are actually yeah. excited to hear. Not perfect, but pretty good for an inaugural podcast. Really? You know, can't wait for the last review this in 2021. Well, We've done it. Thank you, NB. Love the wrestling podcast. Jack's Triple H story was truly moving. Hi, Matthew. Hi, Chris. Jesus! You guys, you guys did a good job. Too. Was it one of your things? <laughs> Here, because I heard about Adam's camera angles. <laughs> uh, yeah. This is somehow both the best and worst thing I've ever seen. Why is Jack playing with a hair bubble? Oh, it was my wristband, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> did anyone else just wish they'd sit down? 31 likes. 
The Lieutenant Wolf. Yeah, standing and socializing for extended amounts of the time gives me anxiety. And all of us, <laughs> apparently. Too awkward. I was getting pissed off. Please sit. I hardly replied anything. But this <laughs> is seriously annoying. Mims, Mims couldn't sit by in silence any longer. Matthew and Ross together is just mm, oh, great. Oh, I... Literally, the, the week and a half of the podcast of, of the trio, if we're going to split yeah. it into two halves. What do you mean? mean uh, please keep on talking about SNK. Great. There's a thumbnail with Elvis Teen Dream on the right. Awesome. It's everything. Jax is at one point, he hides his accent. Did I hear that correctly? Why hide well, it? Thank you, awesome Tara. Job. Not deliberately, just subconsciously. It's you should make these switching. podcasts live. Well, there's one reason they're not it's live. live. It's live at the time of recording. It's live at the time of the recording. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was funny. Timestamps time three years ago. Yeah. That's still one today. This is sort of compared to the current. Comp- That's a good current thing. Current I mean, it's good, isn't it? It's yeah. good. Should we go and look at the the most recent comments and then take a look oh, to yeah, see yeah, yeah, yeah. if um, on week two of the podcast we've got some bloody stools? Oh. I don't think we did. This is so awkward. One day ago. This is so awkward. Oh. Big fan of the podcast. Now start watching it during lockdown. But this is my first time watching the first episode. I hope they still do the watch along while we're here now. Adam's about to burst. I assume that's like the ha ha. Mm. Uh, 200 af- podcasts after this. Congrats. Bubble wrap's putting the time crap show. The great, oh, content. This is great content. Bliss. <laughs> uh. I've always wondered is beers like cause light to cheap over the seas too? Or is Ross looking like a fancy pants drinking an international beer? A fancy cause light? Yeah, it's cheap <laughs> over here as well. Don't worry about that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> randomly show up on recommendations. That's a shame. Oh, we're really, really sorry about that. Right then, so there we go. There's the most recent comments. Now uh, we go back up to number two. Just about like going on um, thirty thousand people did not tune in for week two. Yeah. <laughs> I'm oh, sat- but, but, but look, look. I'm sat down. Well, for example, oh. a thousand less Glad likes as well. Look at the their chairs. To Which, by the so way, so unenthusiastic still. Were so <laughs> they were <laughs> so <laughs> cheap. <laughs> Everyone broke them, didn't they? Yeah. And we had to get the wooden ones with no giving them whatsoever, which was like just sitting on a, uh, a pile of I, wood. I don't like I've been crying. I wonder why we changed them for me. <laughs> I think the formation was my suggestion because it was like a bit awkward we Matthew being in the middle. We look, we look so old. Look at that. There's a few... Three... <laughs> look at this three 40-year-olds. <laughs> Ross, Ross is threatening look. I'm crying. Why what are you looking so, at? <laughs> why are we so old? You look at me or two with a brick. I honestly thought... I honestly thought I looked like younger back then. What's happened here? Like, Video podcast volume two. Video, video podcast like number two. I've got to really hope so. Uh, wonderful. And because the power fiddling with the wristband immediately. Discussion went so well last week. We are joined <laughs> by laugh Bulk Skull and the annoying one from the. Turbo that is nanny for that. There is nanny. Was that an insult? Was that an insult? Reference. I don't know you that well. So we're going Power Rangers. Blah blah blah. We don't got any positive feedback. But so I said, here we are, the Bulk and Skull. Bring the two little crappy with things. Under the crappy ones, plus bulk, bulk, he's fat and skull, skull, because he looks like he's dead. So, I mean, I can say, I've got myself skull, I shouldn't be calling you. Nonsense. What the hell am I on? Nonsense. Oh, just the old silence in there as well. To concisely talk about things. Top draw wrestling analysis. Yes, yes, yes Ross. Is, yes, oh, we man. make uh, Pete Rosenberg. Let's please not watch it. Oh, so comments on this one, please stop. A big part of massive be a part of Cult of Cultaholics. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was nice and positive, but it's like, no, she was saying called the Holic. Could they not get a better table? No, we couldn't. I am. I am t- hey. I'm digging this new series. And Ross is like, I don't know why I'm here, but it's nice. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> Matthew is such a charismatic talker. A son. Oh, reference? <laughs> oh, because I said something that they, they referenced. Oh. So that uh, they knew, knew. So like mm. Matthew's awesome. P.S. Mm. I like obscure band. Sitting Never. down is a good step, but pe- keep getting lower to the floor. <laughs> <laughs> we, we made it there in three steps. Yeah. Right now it's like you're one of those high up tables oh, and chairs, which you were. God. It's worth sacrificing the sound quality you'll get from a root. Uh, whatever. Oh, yeah, uh, sure. Never get rid of Matthew. Haven't still. <laughs> Thank. Oh, two hundred forty-one. Oh, nice. Ooh. I like how. Ooh. I saw a bit of analysis there actually. I like how Ross and Jack seem like guests on Matthew's show. The show has such great potential as they all learn to play off each other. I'm all, um, I've joined you. Oh. You know what? In a weird way. Matthew was so funny. Ah, I... It's all positives. It is, isn't it? Maybe what? We, maybe we just Oh, my God. Maybe we just improved immediately. Jack, Jack was, was I don't remember this at all. <laughs> Where were these positive things about looking at The these? chof. 
We should start calling it the chop. The chop. <laughs> <laughs> they got chairs. Bloody hell. Did we start the two camera, ang- camera angles? I don't think so. Oh, so this no, was... I thought it, yeah, we... Look like Meltzer and Alvarez. Unbearable bastard. Two that times just a flick. You know what he wrote that top 25 moments on the network? He's seen it. No. It's no. just him going around the warehouse and he sees Sean thinking about from back in the day. No, oh, looks like just the one. Then he has a little bit of banter. He's probably healing rip-off jackets. Just like that. Oh. The length's increased as well. Length increased. One wow, camera. We've got chairs. <laughs> We're making slow <laughs> improvement. I love the you know what? That's a rapid also, improvement. That's one. Like, oh, that's it's still not good at all. You're right. Yeah, yeah. I'll look. Look forward to it. Was that when you put on two times speed? It's like a normal conversation. Can you see what number three? How that starts? Number three is called dogs. <laughs> Why was that the thumbnail? Podcast. Yari Pai. Hello. Hey. Welcome. Yo. And if I sit down and shut up to everybody watching, I am. Well, the, Man, that's called Holly. Rubbish video again. That's all right. right. Yeah. The called the Holly video podcast. The light looks nice. He sounded so serious. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no, it's the Holly. I'm that arrogant. I use myself. I think this is similar to. Matthew and his friends. Similar to. We're at least trying. Mr. Ross. Mr. Jack. Hello. Uh, no Power Ranger references this week because <laughs> I haven't got any more. And quite frankly, Power Rangers is something that I watched. It's nice how the views have gone down, but then picked back up again. Out of yeah. Really? You'll so never going to keep wrestling. us down. Should we try four? And that amazing silence. That's a lie. The, oh, Welcome. yes, because the graffiti. <laughs> In Heaton. Oh, yes. Podcast. Ah! <laughs> what? Idea what? Of what type of place we live in. Wow. I was walking here just now. Why is the camera so different each time? To see my friends. What is this pose on my body? There's what a bit of graffiti. Again, I look like I've been crying. You're like a, a, the video. a massive man. Uh, on I'm bent like an uh, Allen key. <laughs> that says, NASA lie, the earth is flat. <laughs> yeah. Look uh, <laughs> we'll at that zoom. Uh, in Flip Gordon brought me for that. <laughs> the place we As live he so Matthew is the cultaholic like Cody Rhodes is really Oh wow. my God. Look out, Pachiti. This gets better every single week without fail. Yeah, Keep it up. that's not hard, but it did. Well, well any number's <laughs> higher than zero. It's episode nine where, you know, when we first did the table set up, like everyone sat in a row. Oh, God, yeah. Why has that gone straight to number 20? Oh, let's see what 20's like. Wrestling podcast. If you like. Whoa! Oh, and the thing! Oh, no. And a bit of beard! Club. I said club instead of cult. Let's start chopping this podcast. <laughs> Seamless. Like, like, cut to us just looking at him. Quite high, plain high Oh, oh no. Good. Orange. No, no, no. Fruit and nut. That's good, good as well. Fruit and nut. I don't like the mint no. ones. I'm not I, do, that's, the I do have grown to appreciate the, right the mint clubs, first. actually. I don't like mint. nuts in me chocolate either. Do you not? No. Nah. What about fruit and nut? What, as two separate commodities? Yeah, the fr- fruit on the left. Oh, man. Right. Yeah, yeah, this that's zany fine. conversation. At least it's, at least it's more shopping. relaxed it's now. It's all right, actually. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> <laughs> it only took... But what if you had a fruit the cult of video oh, podcast? but it's May by this point. Sometimes. So it took a few months. And before we got into the pressing been nominated. of wrestling... Oh, yeah, we've just been wearing all the shirts. My friend had a question for me the other day, and it's really gotten to me, and I thought it'd be a good way to ask this podcast. Well, we came a long way in a short space of time. You know you're on the toilet. But now it's time and to dive into the down. impromptu mm-hmm. and you get tweet that Should I put out that. a while ago. Oh, oh, time. Uh, yeah, we'll pause that if you want. Thank you, Richard. Oh, and we'll pick out some of the best questions. Right, are we ready, guys? Yeah. No. Let's hope there's some good ones. Okay. Stephen Scudez, when the podcast <laughs> first started, what was your initial thought of the first episode? And did you guys think the podcast would last this long? My first thought was, oh dear, oh dear. My first thought, I think, was, oh, that was a bit hard. But I think I was, like, quite optimistic still. But looking back, I, if I'd been aware of how bad it was, I'd have been much more down about it. Yeah. Stephen Scudez also wants us to pose for the same picture in, in the same way as we did on oh, the picture. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, yeah. That's, what, that's probably got, what we should I've do got, for the thumbnail. I've got the hat with me as well. Wow. Oh, yeah. um, Mr. Wrestling that's Jr. That's a good thumbnail idea, Stephen. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, well done, Stephen. Thank you, Steve. Is the tiny table, you you say it, you stand around okay? I hope it's okay. I don't remember the last time we saw it. Where is the tiny table? Where is the tiny actually? table? The tiny table is in the juggling room, as we call oh, it here yes. at Cultaholic Wrestling, where the new... Twitch streaming presenting bit is. We're oh. just fun like that. It's just, it's just, just call it the juggling room. Yeah, because Tom juggled in it once. Um, also, if you could have a wrestler stand in for one of you on the podcast but make no mention of the change, which wrestler would be funniest? That's like a podcast question, that one. Um, what is going on? What is that? It's clicks and all sorts happening. <laughs> Who would be the funniest stand-in? Background stand-in? noise is nothing new here. Who would be the funniest stand-in for me? Uh, oh, who's like the opposite of me? 
Bobby Archie, Brown. Archie near a cane. Yeah, <laughs> someone, someone hard and silent. Oh. And, yeah, I have Dan Barry. Okay, because he looks the same age as me. You know, he's way older, and uh, I think his references would be more topical. Okay, all the way up to 1986. You could have Excalibur. I think Excalibur. Oh, Excalibur! Yeah. Like, Excalibur yeah. hosting it would be funny because yes. he'd be so into it. Well, Imagine. that one wrestler that I've heard of, and you'd be like, that's, that's great. Do you remember episode four where this happened? <laughs> <laughs> ben Ward, how hard was it adjusting to Zoom slash Teams during lockdown? That's a good question. Uh, and uh, and how and do you feel it took a while to find your rhythm again? Yes. Uh, I think yes, but all the videos went on to Zoom. So personally, I didn't notice the podcast being particularly harder. It was Everything was just harder. I actually think it helped in the long run because with Zoom, there is that brief bit of, waiting for someone to hear something yeah. and do that. And I think that helped me in the long run. So oh. I'm like, why don't you actually listen to what people have to say rather than just like, w w words, words, words. It's, no, words. Like, it's like we trained with weights up. on and then when it came to the fight, we were like bloody Goku in Dragon yeah. Ball Z. So we stop your nerd reference. Uh, sorry. No one understands. Yeah. I struggled like, big time after Zoom stopped because my Zoom setup upstairs in the office was like one screen for Zoom, yeah. another screen for notes. And you could look at them seamlessly and look like you were making really good points off the top of your head. <laughs> And then it came back to having like, oh, no, it's down here now. I can't quite present and read. You know what I mean? Yeah. That was a whole new skill set to learn once again. These are some good questions. I'm enjoying this. Right. Yeah. Where are we? Uh, including those who have helped host during an original host's absence, who would you say is the mum of the group? The dad, <laughs> the child, the fun uncle, and the uncle that pisses everyone off on Christmas Day. That's a lot. That's a lot of... The fun uncle is you. Oh, thank you. You You're are the zany, fun. wacky fun uncle who Matthew, you can't oh. quite control. Oh, I appreciate that. That's Matthew why the podcast isn't live, because Matthew's mouth. Yes. That's, <laughs> I might not yeah, want to be monetized. <laughs> well, I suppose Pachiti's... The mum of the group. Pachiti's the mum. Yeah, he's big because he, Because he didn't, didn't dare... He didn't give us enough criticism at the start. Yeah. He was too I just motherly. want you to do well. <laughs> yeah. A dad would have gone, all right, stop, stop. What are the stop. other For things? the love of God, just act normal. The dad? The dad... <sighs> I don't know if the I don't know if the podcast has a dad. Mm. The child, me, <laughs> and the fun uncle. Uh, not sorry, the uncle that pisses everyone off on Christmas Day. Well, you're the odd one out, but I'd say that's definitely Sam. So, I say, you're, I say you're, you're the dad then, I guess. I'll yeah, be the dad. Be I'll dad. be the dad. Shows up drinking. Did you guys? This is from wrestling's finest, Harley T. Hang on, Harley T. Morris. Uh, did you guys have any other names for the podcast in mind, or was it always going to be the Cult of Holic Wrestling podcast? I think it was always going to be the Cult of Holic Wrestling, wrestling podcast. podcast. Yeah. Um, Lamau, was was it really that bad? Says Jay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Do you ever look back on the mailbag saga of Macho Man, Elizabeth, and Hogan oh. and wonder how they're doing from Ollie W? I do now. We should put that as a best of compilation. What was that about again? Entire saga. So there was a lad who compared himself to Hogan. Yeah. Oh, he's trying he to ask fancied, the last out. He yeah. fancied. He fancied savages. He fancied Elizabeth. But, but he knew that their relationship, quite arrogantly, he knew that their relationship wasn't yeah. right. And then in the end, she did actually break up with Hogan and get with Savage. Yeah. Uh, Savage and get with Hogan. I do wonder now. Uh, what are they doing if you're if watching? If you're out there listening, yeah. Let us know. Uh, Graham Wright says, when did you decide to switch the host from the small child stand between you? I used that picture on the tweet. Um, and, <laughs> and pull in the, manson, the handsome musketeer look like Matthew Gregg. Oh, bless you. When did that happen? Oh, when did that happen? <laughs> oh, right. Do you want an answer? I can't remember when I grew the beard. Oh, lockdown. Right. Zoom. I came out looking like this. Then we goes, God, Matthew, you look way better. Matthew, I'm, I'm sorry to tell you this, but... You're uh, all right there. Yeah. It, it's That's a good compromise. But it was stuff. me going, no, I have to look good and professional and shaved. And it's just like... You see us? I don't know well, why I waited so long to try and grow a beard again. Yeah. <laughs> Reese Bithel, I hope I said that right. What happened to that little table? <laughs> Why does it <laughs> also? Who was the head of the little table? <laughs> uh, First impression after uh, how relieved. Gary Monroe says, "How relieved were Gar. you?" Uh, oh, Gar Monroe. It's Gar Monroe. Gar Monroe. I know yeah. that one. Uh, how relieved were how relieved were you? What was said as soon as Pachiti said cut? And why did Jack think joke was a good sign off? I can't remember what the joke was, but we no, just watched it. But did you say the word joke? Oh, it was um, <laughs> join us on three. Hey. Joke, joke. Yeah, yeah you really said the word joke, and that's so, how we ended the. Um, I wouldn't have thought that was a good sign off. I would have just been panicking and trying to trying to 
God trying yeah, to make it work. We're all panicking. Yeah. yeah. I can't remember the immediate aftermath either. I can't remember us being negative though. The fact that we were walking away from the table and we're five <laughs> paces away from it before the camera had stopped rolling so really says could. a lot. Yeah. I'll say this though, for the first few I don't want to say months, actually we do the podcast and sometimes I'll do like some that make you laugh or whatever. It was a little joke that worked. But for the longest I don't know how long it lasted, but for a while I did think I should just say sorry and just like take I'm out. I'm just like oh, bothering you. This is not working. It's all working. I'll out. give you the money back in installments or whatever. I never I never like, thought I was never like God, this is Matthew. It was more like in my head because of course, in, such in your a head, lack it would of communication, be, yeah. which is obviously the way things are sorted out. We we wouldn't get any feedback. But she wouldn't say, "All right, well, how about more of this? How about less of that?" It was just, "All right, come in next week and do yeah, it again." In yeah. fairness, and we'll learn via osmosis, I guess. If I just watched three people turn in that performance, I wouldn't know where to begin with the yeah, feedback I either. either. Yeah, but I, that's why I, you know, I'm like a soldier in the army. I'm waiting for instructions. You know, what, what do you want? Okay, yeah. we haven't said us anything. I'll carry on doing what I'm doing, and yeah. that's kind of what it was. So maybe benefit of hindsight, we could have gone together and you know cornered Pachiti and gone, all right, can you tell us what to do? I spoke, spoke, uh, spoke, spoke. Mo- sp- oh my god, spoke more than once a week. That mm. would have been yeah, yeah. Because yeah, yeah. yeah, for context as well, for the longest time, we would just see each other. Hi, how you doing? Cool. Three, two, one, and here we are, yeah. like Harley Race traveling NWA champion. <laughs> how you doing, Bruno? You know. <laughs> Cowboy Bobbit says, why Matthew? Not even a dig at him, just why? <laughs> <laughs> um, I think... I asked him, but she, I think, woke well, up the next day and he put his phone. Oh, I said, I said, I could not do a job. <laughs> I think also, like, it it was quite early on in Cultaholic, wasn't it? And it was... Oh, yeah, yeah, it was, really. It, it was, was before it even officially launched, wasn't it? And Right, okay, when the decision was made. Yeah. I think, I mean... It, it was it was just sort of made sense, didn't it? Because we wanted to we'd set out on our own. Mm. It's quite scary in that, and we needed a bit of a link to. Yeah. And also, it helped that we knew you to various degrees. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, just My right. rationale was you were part of the the perception that I had that you were part of the crowd that hated us at what culture. So if we got you in and had you in for a podcast and showed, hey, we're not we're not too bad, us, you know, oh. that would help us with a portion oh, of the audience okay, makes sense. who maybe wouldn't give us a chance. Yeah. I mean, look at the comments there. Yeah. Everyone was everyone was buzzing. So oh, it's amazing that. Yeah, it's not an I would look. Plus, you're Matthew Botcher, man. Yeah, you're Matthew. Yeah, but I, I'm at the point like yourselves. All I see is the negativity. So it's like true. Oh, yeah, it's true. yeah. wasn't comments yeah. Yeah. Jesus. But I think there's also maybe. Do you think it helps the fact that? Hey, okay. If you did this, maybe with somebody who's in you see every day, it wouldn't be the same. But because it's yeah, maybe yeah, that's true. Fun Uncle Matthew show. Yeah, up. I reckon that helps keep the energy. To be yeah. fair, yeah. Matthew's here. He's got ice cream, and he's you know got a fiver for all of us. <laughs> <laughs> What's the? This is from Daniel Hutchinson. What's the deepest, darkest secret of the podcast? Oh, I don't know what answer. said on the podcast or the podcast of itself. the podcast. Oh. Just a general deep dark secret. Probably Richard Ooh. Tubman. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> I've got one. Oh yeah. I don't know if I should say it. Go on. We can edit it out if it's too bad. After the first episode of the podcast, he handed in his notice. A member of what culture who shall remain nameless messaged Adam Pacini and was like, not brilliant, was it? Oh, I know who that is referring to. And I know because it was about me. Uh, was it? Oh, so it was another comment I used to say. Oh, I thought it was then. just in general. I didn't know it was about you, so I wouldn't have... The comment that I was told, this was by someone who... I Unless these are two right different what culture people. Uh, I could see it being the same person. Um, that the person I thought was cool with who works at that other place. To be fair... Apparently I've, told I've someone got, in be... passing, hey, I heard you got Mafu. Huh? I'll be put some butts on the seats. Oh, oh, what's that effect? Oh, that'll be, fair, be good. In fairness... Presumably after these... But then again, how dare they say that? <laughs> Oh, wait, they were completely justified. In fairness, what I was going to say was that first person that I mentioned, it, I I don't think it was like in a spiteful way. I think it was more like, but she was like, oh, what did you think? And they were like, honestly? <laughs> God knows why he asked. Hey, people we're not that friendly with. What do you think of the worst podcast can, we've ever put out? We should leave that in. Oh, whatever. That's fine. Cavani's husband says, whose idea was it to have the podcast and who decided it would be you three specifically? Don't know, actually. I think the podcast was just a natural thing to do. Oh uh-huh. yeah, you you guys, we we did one at what culture, so yeah, just sort of made But sense. like you didn't go, oh yeah, I'd love to do a podcast. Yeah. I'm not sure why it was us three, because you look like you've been grabbed in or <laughs> like well, Mr. Was... T get on a plane levels of not want to be I there. Just, I felt like I was the third wheel. Like you two had a, a bit of a relationship before before that podcast started, and I was like, oh, uh, 
And I'm uh, awkward anyway, so I was like, oh, oh, oh doubly. But uh, I wanted to, to, to be honest with you, I thought Adam should have been on the podcast from the start. But that couldn't happen because he was so busy. So what's yeah. the guy to do, eh? Uh, yeah, yeah, that's why it was us two, at least. Yeah. Because there was literally no one else. <laughs> Sam was busy editing. Adam was busy doing everything else. So it was me and Ross. That was literally it. Yeah. Hmm. yeah. Um, could any of you pick up any dog? <laughs> no, no, that's Quentin a, Quarantino. Oh, it's, oh, Good back then. You see me guns. Oh. It's an outrageous name. Uh, claim from Adam Pacitti that I don't believe him. Me neither. No. It goes as and large. he hasn't done it on camera yet, has he? Yeah. No, he's picked up. He's not picked uh, up a Saint Bernard for goodness. He's sake. picked up a stone dog and he was struggling. He can talk the talk, but he can't dog the dog. No, he can't. <laughs> from from uh, uh, <laughs> Around SP97. Is the podcast the highlight of your working week? I would say yes, it is. I would say... Is it really now? I would say most weeks, yeah. Unless oh. unless there's been something like particularly exciting. Or Why whatever. is that? Because it's more silly and it's not like as much of an effort. It's the, it's the, oh. it's Which it okay. sounds bizarre to say, having just watched the biggest effort and struggle ever. But yeah. Like people can say what they want about YouTubers as a profession or YouTube as a profession, but it, the amount of work that goes into making one of our videos is work. Mm. I don't care what you say, the research that goes in. in. And then the presenting. Mm. Mm. There's Every video I do, apart from this, it feels like I'm presenting, whereas the podcast is just literally, I forget the camera's there, me yeah. for this one. Yeah. It's just us sitting down having a conversation. It's the one part that doesn't feel like work because mm. the rest of it feels like work. And that'll, there'll be people out there with proper jobs going, oh, that's a load of bollocks, that load of Ross. But it, honestly, this is a proper At least job. the way it feels, yeah. like, yeah, mm. compared to the other aspects of the job, this feels like the least worky work. Yeah. It's more of a shoot, brother. John Dennis says, why is Matthew so small? <laughs> <laughs> what are you on about? I'm 5'7". <laughs> Above average Mike Sanders. Um, Florian says, based on Jack's famous Saints beanie, what are your opinions on the season so far? Oh, right. Well, I don't actually... At the minute, it's a Chicago Bulls one. But yeah, the Saints one, I don't know where that even is. Um, I remember changing it. When we moved over to Cultaholic, thinking it's a new era. I don't know how the season's going. I've not been keeping a tape with the microphone. New era, I'm new sorry. hat. I'm sorry, but if you do care, I actually support the Baltimore Ravens. Whoa. Oh. Good morning, Baltimore. Ulp says, why did you guys go into it so unprepared? <laughs> That's a very fair Good question. point, mate. It wasn't, Good point. it wasn't being unprepared, was it? It was literally, you can't... Like, fake like chemistry, can you? It's just yeah. it's something that happens over time. And you literally, you guys had the working day you were busy like nine or whatever time that was and we didn't have time for chemistry half hour or all right i'll do this i'm more about this or da, da, da. so yeah if we had that yeah. so if we'd had that we would have been all right we just didn't have the time or the yeah. resources to do a few yeah. few testers it was yeah. all get the get the content out make some money to pay some bills yeah, you, you can't do the olympics without warming up <laughs> no, Rebecca says how long into the first podcast did you decide that sitting down would be better <laughs> pretty early on within um, seconds yeah and did you think the podcast uh, would still be three hours long if you had to stand no <laughs> good <laughs> god <laughs> no it would not oh um, what's going to replace this week in wrestling well that hasn't been fully determined but the tentative Ooh. idea this isn't happening by Ooh. the way oh, would, would you, you rather, rather yeah. <laughs> <laughs> get it do, back she would do that Come on. no no this isn't happening, by the way, unless the the review show you saw on Twitch for Survivor Series becomes a thing for Raw and SmackDown and AEW yeah. NXT when me and Jack will start getting involved and that will save us to repeating ourselves on a Friday morning what was said on the Twitch videos. So what that's I, not coming for a, a while What I always yet. assumed, but I, again, this is pure speculation on my part, would it, would it be some sort of like abridged version of This Week in Wrestling? Like more like headlining? The tentative discussion we've had so far is going to be like you bring your highlight of the week of wrestling to the table. I like that. Yeah. I like that because or, you just go and don't care about that, don't care about would that. Would you yeah. rather? <laughs> or would you rather, yes. Well, uh, Kerr says, why does Jack look the same age he did over 200 weeks ago? Aww. Thank you. Um, I don't know. But I mean... More cigarettes. More cigarettes. <laughs> it keeps you young, yeah. kid. <laughs> Archie, continuing the Jack theme, says, could you ask Jack the 100 million lines versus one of every Pokemon oh, question just to my. piss him off? It was a billion lines and the lines would win. Yeah. No ask Tom way. Campbell if any Japanese wrestling company Triple H wants to buy as well. Jack says... No... Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Jack says, can you answer, why has Ross and Matthew's appearance changed like they are wearing legendary armor, yet Jack is the exact same. <laughs> like they are wearing, wearing legendary <laughs> armor. It was leveled up. Oh, wearing legendary. Um, wearing With the, the first island, you start off the game. 
Jack is still wearing his same level one beanie. Why yes, is this? See, there we go. Why is Jack's character pro- progression taking so long? I don't know. I guess I'm, maybe I'm like bottoms. <laughs> I don't know. Still in Lambda Town going, I don't know where to go. Um, uh, I think that might be it, you know. How uh, big is Batista's I like, dick I like from to Timmy think uh, Oh, there we go. I like to think I'm less spotty. Uh, On that first one, I was a bit spotty that day. Well, the lighting's a lot better. We're not zoomed in with all our negatives highlighted for the world. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I go to a barber's now to get me hair cut. Oh. Don't cut, me, cut it like... myself with a Remington one blade. Oh, you actually were cut, uh, doing your hair yourself. Oh, yeah, that was like the, a little joke. No, I had the Remington. It was like a half, like a crescent shape. You used to hold in your hand right, like right, that. Right. One all over. See oh. you later. Innovator. Yeah. Now I go to a barber's. Nice. And I've grown a beard and I've lost a bit of weight. So good. Get in. Get in. That's the question. So yeah. Do you know what? The positives of that were, from that, we've come this far. We now like each other. <laughs> Which is a good thing. That's always a plus. And we have to remind ourselves, one of the things anyone, if they want to do a podcast or pick up a sport or anything in general, the first step of being good at something is being crap at it first. Yes, it could be nice about a bit more experience or talking, but the fact that from that we've got to this point, I think there's a bit of positivity to be found. Yeah. A bit. Yeah. Yeah. A a yawning chasm. (laughs) Of Massive. positivity. Yeah. <laughs> the gap is so wide between that and now. Evil Knievel couldn't jump it. Yeah. So it has ah. come a long way, though, hasn't it? Uh, genuinely, oh, I was genuinely two shocked. Extra hours. Genuinely was shocked at how bad it was. Yeah. But that at least means we've done even better than I thought. <laughs> it's know? a real story of Christmas. Yes. Ah. Good tidings, one and all. Do we do, do, we do the normal sign off or what, how do we sign this off? Well, this Should is. I just go joke and end it? Dro- <laughs> yeah. And then just a really loud cultaholic. <laughs> Richard, just play the music really, really loud <laughs> now. <laughs> Aye, that's it. Yeah, thank you very much for joining us. Thank you very much for putting up with us because we know that there is, and it's amazing to think of watching that, a lot of people who watched those first ones and kept watching. Yeah. yeah. And if you weren't one of those people, don't worry. There's no need to go back to the start. But as long as you keep on watching, we appreciate you. Hope you have a lovely Christmas. Hanukkah or Kwanzaa, wherever you are in the world. Same goes for you two lads. You two. And always you, a pleasure. And, you. and on the day we're yourself. recording this, happy birthday, Matthew. Thank you. <laughs> oh. No, it's December. You don't have oh. But yes, no, thank it's you Christmas very much. Eve, babe. That's right. <laughs> in the drunk <laughs> oh. Yes. It is a happy birthday with you lads. Oh, Happy birthday oh. to Jesus tomorrow as well, eh? Yeah, on three. Happy birthday, Jesus. <laughs> One, two, three. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Jesus. Jesus. Joke. Joke. <laughs> <laughs>